That soundtrack is so good, though. <laughs> Your stream just clicked on for me. I'm like, oh. Nice. Is installing a mod as easy as just like Nexus or what? It's yeah, it's just Nexus. Nice. Oh. Yeah, that freaking. Oh, no, it's the same thing. I thought it wouldn't, uh... I like the audio going when I alt tab, but alright. Here we go. New game. Uh, At least everything paused when I alt tab. There we go. If this was a drinking game, would all be in the hospital by now? <clears throat> oh, Bethesda game? No way, that's crazy. I thought Bethesda only makes like games. Never. I don't remember what my screenshot button is. Moon of what? Seals are good. Oxygen's good. Just do what you did last time and you'll find. Follow my one simple rule. That is. Hella. What's my one simple Listen rule? Listen to Lynn. Boss lady knows best. Exactly. Listen to me. Mining's just <laughs> like any other job. Go stand. Oh, dude, we're going to Rock and Stone? Go home with a pocket full of credits at the end of the day. Yeah, totally. It's just like, um... Dude, we're doing some Rock and Stone. Except uh, with more cave-ins, lasers, and You're accidental in the mine. We're crafting the, the Minecraft. Thank you. That's crazy. Ah, you're going to be fine. Your first outing was solid. And, you know, let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That's why I keep him around. 
good pep talks. Yeah, and the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, we'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in the house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good Dusties. feeling about you. A group hug now or at the end of the shift? <sighs> one of these days, Hella, I am going to leave you behind. Promises, promises. <laughs> All right, where's motion blur? Cool. Cool low. Sensitivity. Wait. Well, just let me know now. Is aiming down sights the same sensitivity as like, or they do? Uh, you know, is it like does it feel slower whenever you aim down? Like when we were playing, what was it? Uh, Redfall. It might be a little bit slower, but it, it might be. I didn't huh. notice much. Okay. Okay. Let's see <clears throat> what we've got. How are we on time? A uh, little longer. Grab some samples. Always. Uh, but not you. Check on Isabel. Make sure she eases up on the breach. I don't feel like getting buried alive today. Roger that. Remember that thing. Whoa. We go a hundred. Keep your breathing steady and never take that helmet off, darling. Forbid we drill on a rock with breathable atmosphere. Know what I love about working in Free Star Collective Space? Fewer regs. A job like this in the United Colonies? Huh. Red Oh, it's use of freaking console command to steal achievements. I just want. Where's my. It's. Where's it's, my FOV? It's, it's certain. You can't. There's specific um, commands and there's no FOV slider. That is crazy. There's mods that add it in, but yeah, there's no FOV. SMH. Hey, can I talk to you? Uh, you think we'll be done here soon? Now I hear this is the last dig. What are you doing? Calvin! No! Ah, no, no, no! It's a laser, not a sledgehammer! Ease up! Benning, if you got paid per break, you'd be a millionaire! Let's go! Yeah, yeah. Hey, man, you're trying his best. I'm busy. Anyone else to bother? No exception. Come on, pick it up! Troy, what's the yield? Minimal at this point. 
Occasional glimmer, but it's weak. What do you think? Stay the course? No, ma'am. Juice ain't worth the squeeze. Well, okay then. Let's call this one tapped. Why don't you move over to that big vein we looked at? Yes, ma'am. No, you want. Oh, my grab this. I don't know. Oh. Dusty, you're up. Take that cutter you grabbed and mine what you can. Metal deposits are in that cavern. I'll shout out when I need you. No, oh, man. You got a few more digs to go before I feel like talking to you. Just trying to get through my shift. All right, chill, chill. They're really at it. Cool, very nice. Don't. What we're after? It'll read as an anomaly. That's what I was told, anyway. Okay, now you're starting to freak me out. Relax. It's just another job. Come on. We're getting close. I think. Yeah, everything is just. Well, in seriously, uh, there's something really effed up about this. Where is it, Hella? It's chill. Through there. I think. Okay, you, you're up. Something Me. goes wrong in there. We'll come get you. Uh, <laughs> why would anything go wrong? Would you shut up? Both of you do your jobs. Client is on his way. Hmm. I can't do photo mode hey, yet. Don't all look right. at me. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> Wow. Um, still getting weird gravity readings. I, I guess that's a good thing. Just keep going. Do you see anything? Um, floating rocks. That's about it. Here goes the break of mineral policy. Well, what the hell? Alright. What the heck is that? Space magic stuff. Oh my god, we're tripping balls. Oh shoot, dude. This is like dead space. This is some. It's gonna turn everyone evil. Hey, come on. Come on. 
Okay, take it easy. You were out cold. Uh, no physical damage. Mentally, the jury's still out. You know who you are? No. New recruit for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this look familiar? Oh snap! Time to create my character, huh? It's time. A mesh customization can be changed later by visiting a Gen X facility. Oh, bless. You change your character whenever. We start off as. Whoa, that freaking mala dude. All right, let's work from. Let's work off 29, see what we can do with that. No, wait, what was it? The other one I was looking at. Work off 32, let's see what we can do with that. Now, what if this affects things? <sighs> oh, crazy. It's like Saints Row, but not. <laughs> I'm assuming this doesn't actually affect gameplay. No. Just cosmetics. Uh, that's fair. At least, or at least, the character customization is like in a white background so I can actually see what I'm changing. That's it. Only two walk cycles. Yeah, one's male, one's female. I don't like this bar thing. With the one for the at the bottom of the skin. Plate. Yeah, it, like I thought, it doesn't really make like you know what I mean. It's because of like the the extra weird DNA line things. Yes, it looks like you have more options than you actually do. Yeah, it's like, well, I don't know which one is number three or five. I guess that makes sense because, you know, on console, but. Pretty funky. Who do they hear last? Wait. Okay, thank God. I was like, I was like, is that it? Oh, I can scroll down. Face stuff.
Oh. Zoom in. 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 Zoom in.
Oh my god. Ford, is it? I like, do not notice the difference. <laughs> Dude, can this guy just not move? <laughs> Welcome back. Thanks. interesting way to like instead you're not really adjusting every like you're kind of just mixing different presets yeah. you're just like blending them can shift their mouth left and right. I've never seen a game do that. Teeth. just reminds me of um, Yondu from Guardians of the Galaxy <laughs> with his jacked up teeth. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah.
crazy? I don't. Oh wait, I'm gonna go back to John this. I'm not seeing any changes with the freaking jaw. I'm blending them. Was official here. Oh, okay, okay. Refine, what does refining do? Quality intensity.
crazy scars. Those are actually like scars is just oh, I just painted on. Dang. Dirt. Okay, here's time. Don't forget, I don't know if you meant to do it on purpose or if what? you were just doing what? the teeth. You left it on four. Oh, no, no, yeah, I haven't done it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, no. Time to make all this work into making a character I'm never going to see. I mean, to be honest, you actually see him a decent amount. Really? Yeah. Well, I know Fallout 4 did have third-person cutscenes or dialogue. Uh, where was hair? Some, some good hairstyles, some of them. Some of them are really good. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, some wild hair colors. Do be, do be. Oh. I went with some, like, blue hair. I'm digging that. Number 16.
You could change like, I don't know, there's a bit more stuff. Yeah, I mean, it's Fallout character building for you. <laughs> yeah, basically. All right, what is this? Classes. Uh, Beast Hunter. From the Ashta to of Aquila. Uh, you better learn to track them down. In space, the greatest commodity is oxygen. And the increased lung capacity gained by regular physical fitness. Wherever there are wanted individuals, there are those who profit from their capture. And your quarry knows that of can't out hide. Reveal a journey. No information on file about your past. Wait, is this just lore or is this actual skills? No, it's actual skills. Okay, starting skills. Yeah, it's your starting skills. Personal laser weapons are in widespread use across xenobiologists. Good, bad, who's right is it to say? Considering the popularity is it familiar with such weapons in space. Okay, can I hover over to see? Ba, 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 ba. Ronin, masterless, masterless, and unbound, you wander the settled systems as a blade to hire. To some, you were a simple mercenary, to others, a hero, and to select few, a nightmare they could never wake from. Did you be a lost art? Close, okay. One thing about it, take skill, patience, good materials, mine, there's a guy. Let those of uh, other hothead uh, pilots obsess. Industrialist. Often accomplish far more than simply shooting first and ask questions later. No discovered minerals. Gangster, you were always disgusted by suckers killing themselves to make an honest wage. Shotgun justification. Boxing and theft. Cyberneticist. 
robots, more toys, and more amps. Good for parlor tricks. The colony war may have made implants. Okay. Screw it. The wars are over. Peace now reigns the settled systems. But only because th there are those quietly fighting to keep. Because of you, agreements were signed. Wars were heeded. Lives were spared. Let us do industrials. There was a time when all he wanted to be was a titan of industry, maybe a ship designer or mega corp exec. Thankfully, that skill set never goes out of style in the cell systems. Personal laser weapons are in widespread use across the cell. You said exploration is a lost art. You didn't listen as the major factions argued over the space they separate, desperately tried to control. You were busy uncovering the wonders of the cell systems. Diplomat. Alien DNA. You volunteered for a controversial experiment that combines alien and human DNA. As a result, you start with increased health and oxygen. Oh, traits. When a luxurious, customizable house on a peaceful planet unfortunately comes with a... No. These huh? are optional. These are optional. You don't have to choose them. You sunk. Uh, wait, you quiet. Required. These are optional. You don't have to choose these. Oh. They this this is just lore. Something. Oh, yeah. no? No, they do change things, some things about yeah. the game. Well, I mean, some say stuff with increased health and oxygen. Unless of that's... Yeah. But there's, 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 like, there's consequences to most of them. All, all of them, I think. Oh. Screw it. All right. Wait, so I shouldn't add any of them, or? I mean, it's up to you. It just changes your game a little. All right. Your parents are alive and well, and you can visit them at their home, but you automatically send 10% of your credits home to them every week. You grew up in the mean streets of Neon. You gain access to special dialogue options and better rewards from some missions on Night Neon. Crime bounty and, uh, can't be combined with any other faction uh, allegiance trait. I'll put a price on your head and word has to spread occasionally or Oh Being concerned gives you an edge. Your health is low, you do extra damage. <laughs> That's interesting, yeah, like I'm seeing I'm reading these and yeah, they do change some things. Yeah, I, I like how they do it. I think I chose one of them out of the have being able to do three. 
I forget which one. He grew up as a member of the Sanctum Universum. Getting access to a special chest full of items in Sanctum now. I just put his access to. Grew up worshipping the Great Serpent. Grav jumping provides temporary boost to health oxygen, but health and oxygen are lowered if you don't continue jumping regularly at like an addiction. But it's become limited to space. Health and oxygen are increasing in space, but decrease on the surface can be combined with terror. You have crew trained in this. In the surface. Health oxygen increase on the surface, but decrease when you're in space. You gain access to specially night colony dialogue options and better rewards for some missions. For the fact, or crime bounty and other is greatly increased. I to the feelings of others performing actions companions. Performing actions they don't like have performance effect. Oh, okay. You've earned the attention of an annoying, adoring fan who will show up randomly and jabber at you instantly. Join a crew and give you gifts. Got it. Alright, so glass cannon. Uh, don't piss off people by accident, <laughs> and some annoying person got it. <laughs> some annoying person. <laughs> I don't know what that. I don't know what the bad part is. It will show up on. I don't think that one has uh, the. I think the bad part about that one is that he just constantly annoys you. Oh sure, but... I, I like that. Bring <laughs> yourself. That's pretty interesting. Alright. Alright, here we go. Where's the save button? How do I save my character? Uh, what do you mean? There should just be a save, so I don't have to, like, if I ever want to just... I don't know. If I ever reset, but just want to reuse the same character again. Oh. <laughs> Finish! Ah, uh, he, him, uh... Chat GPT. <laughs> That's what I did. Give me a cool <laughs> space. I'm terrible at making names. Name. Give me a cool sci fi space name that starts with. Z. All right, thanks, Chad GBT. I was like, give me a cool space name that starts with Z. With one syllable, Ziff. Ziff. Oh, now. Oh. Is that what people were... Wait, was this the video? Aaron posted man rages over pronouns. Yeah, because you can only do him and he, him, and she, her. He, him, she, her, they, them. Hmm.
Okay, here we go. Huh, forgot. Former diplomat, right? Ah, yes, you of might course. Have said long words to the wrong people to wind up here. Well, you got the sample. Client's on his way. Then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? No. It was incredible, like a dream or a vision. Easy there, high flyer. Probably just the endorphins kicking in when you passed out. Don't go having an experience on me. You'll walk it off. More importantly, we got what we were looking for. We did. All this trouble for that stupid thing? Huh. Sure don't look like much. Never mind what it looks like. It's worth more than this mine has pulled in all month. We'll be... Speak of the devil. I feel that. Hey, you all right? Maybe don't do any heavy lifting for a while? Our constellation Whoa. contact is on the approach. Look good. Wait, the explorers group? Thought they were kind of a joke. Not a joke. You're just too young to know better. Hey, I'm just saying they got a reputation. Hell, I bet half the crew here doesn't even believe they really exist. Half the crew doesn't believe Earth exists, but it's still there. Same with Constellation. Yeah, but come on. Exploring space? How they Who sucker you anymore? to join? Ain't the Fall space we've already got complicated pamphlets? enough? Not to them, okay? That feels weird. My the game jitters when I'm like moving and walking. It Looking is. around, it's fine, but mine doesn't do that. Hmm. You think it's V-Sync? It is V-Sync. What? It is? Yeah. That's weird. What the heck? You saw it too, right? <laughs> yeah, you could just see it Land like sure stuttering. Guess she would know, being the boss and all. Let's get to this meeting. All right, Dusty. Airlock. Put your helmet on. All right, helmet on. Here's where I crashed for the first time. All right, quick saving then. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? Talk which quest is trying to hide by the way. It's not like Hutter Persuasion. I'm assuming those are factions. Client is here. Let's go. That means equip. Got it. Cool. Fancy. I need a walk button. A lot of people were complaining that you walk faster than the NPC. Yeah. 
I think my manager was saying the same thing. Barrett? Man. Been a long time. <laughs> yes, it has. That mine on Bendy, right? Whoa. Hellhole, like this place. Rare mineral contract. You uh, you ought to now, huh? put away your weapon. So you found something right here. The new guy found what? it. What? Hold That's R. Right. And everything went cool. Mm -hmm. Just like grabbing those minerals on Bendy. Kazam and no Bendy. Wait, what? I don't know why it's on Bendy. Yeah, it's weird. Not cool. He passed out after the extraction. Woke up saying all kinds of nonsense. Is that right, cowboy? Went on a trip. Huh? Yeah, yeah, pretty much tripped out. Oh, uh, like that. What would you know about that? Well, you could say that the infinite possibilities of the universe are full of everything but coincidences. Yeah, you call it that. <laughs> That fun, huh? Not the most gentle push into the great mysteries of space, but hey, been there. Look, just hand over the credits, and I'll be happy to never see this thing, or you, ever again. That's why I like you, Lynn. All business. Barrett, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. I Where? really thought I'd lost them. Barrett? Oh, this is pretty cool. Oh, grab a weapon. Okay. But I need ammo. In the box. What in the box is ammo? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 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 pirates. Hey, yo, get away from me. Uh, I'm stuck. You have. Oh, why is? What a grab. Uh, keep pressing R near items, and it keeps bringing me to here. <laughs> Yeah, so you can, like, if you're in the world, you can click loot, but if you hit the R, it pulls up that, so you can see a, a list of everything. Uh, you can, like, visually see them, what they look like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See what you're, like, yeah, okay, I see. That's also, like, the transfer inventory, so then you can, like, switch to your inventory with Q. So if you had to like put something in someone else's body that you want to get rid of. Hmm, okay. Inventory. Weapons. I have two equipped. I'll give you a quick tip because it's very confusing. Mm. So they don't explain this at all. So you have your weapons, right? Yeah. If you hit, so choose like the pistol, right? And yeah, hover yeah, yeah. over it and hit B, the letter B. Yeah, favorite? Yes. Oh, quick select. So then that is your hot bar. 
That's your one, two, three, four, five. They don't tell you that. I was like, when I was playing, I'm like, why can't I just hit one for my gun, two for my melee? So you actually have to set it as your favorites and then put it in the slot that you want it to I go in. I thought favorite would have meant, you know, just, just to have it as your favorite. That's what, I, that's what I thought too. But then when I hit it, I was like, oh, you that's how you have it so you can quickly pull them out and switch between them. Oh, okay. Fuck up some pirates! Ah! Ah, you're a bozo. Okay, so. Oh. Hey, personal modified maelstrom. I don't know if I'm going to get used to this FOV. I mean, there's a mod you can add if you want to change it. Hmm. It is pretty trash. That's the first thing I went to do was change my FOV and I couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't feel like 90. I don't think it's 90. Because even 90 would be wider. No. That means you saw it. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, visions. You're coming with me to Constellation. You're part of this now. I ask for this. What is Constellation? You ever stare up at the stars at night, wondering what's out there? Well, that's us. That's where we go. What? Oh, 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 I didn't ask for this. Hey, um, I wasn't going to bring it up, but we don't exactly know what the artifact might have done to your head, and Constellation is really the only group qualified to help. Oh, no, Barrett. No. You think you're just going to take off after the mess you caused? Oh, right. I guess I did just put you all on the Crimson Fleet hit list. How about I stay... And I send your Dusty here in my place. I, 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 I know, I know, but he's not some miner anymore, Lynn. Soon as he touched that rock, something changed. Don't tell me you can't feel it. Fine. It's a deal. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. What about the mine? Now that we've been attacked... Oh. We've got to pack up and move on. Argos will come for the rest of us. You get going. No way. Not my job. Don't you get it? You don't have a job here anymore. You are those explorers now. Like it or not. Just go, alright? Figure out what happened. I want to do some more mining rock. and crafting. Well, or mining. That's settled. No more rock and stone. Get him to the lodge. No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo? Again. Very Protocol well. Indigo? Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. Oh, uh, watch? Oh, do a smartwatch. Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, questions?
All of the Crimson Fleet after you. They're just following the loop, like pirates do. And I have something of a reputation as a loot collector. What exactly did we dig up? That, my friend, is the million credit question. And Constellation can find the answer. With your help. Who are you? What's Constellation? I didn't know what's going on. See, that's the problem with the settled systems. Too easy to take everything for granted. While everyone else is busy playing politics, we're the ones braving the unknown, charting the vastness of space. Without us, the galaxy is just a big room with the lights turned out. You're giving me a sh your ship? Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Vasco will keep you on course. Besides, I'm making an exception since you can tell Constellation about that vision you had. Why send me? Should you go? Come on. You're really not at all curious about that light music show you experienced? Why it only affected no. you? No. Because if you didn't notice, we've all been handling it since with no problem. I, I, see it, I just want to go back to the mines, dude. But they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. And you're part of it now. All right. And Vasco, don't let him break my ship. <laughs> I don't know, man. I just want to go back in the mines. Rock and stone. <laughs> We're still in one piece. We go back to Minecraft and. There's it's the way those characters move. Peel off. Even this robot. It's like the animation's there, but it just it's just kind of sliding. Just up the ramp, Captain. I'll be in the external robotics bay. It appears you are the new captain of the frontier. I don't wanna. Hey, uh I don't know how you kept your cool back there. I just did. Staying around isn't helping us out any. Go. Make Get that artifact to constellation. This is all one big write-off now. Uh. Hey, uh, sounds like you gotta go. Bear not coming along. Captain, protocol indigo is in effect. Captain, I'll guide you as best I can. Of course. As Barrett likes to say, it's as easy as learning to ride a bike. I will attempt to boost the shields just in case there are any difficulties. Of course. Do I have to take it? Can you I just drill, okay. Vasco. Protocol Indigo means no deviations, no distractions, no dalliances. In short, no fun. Unless, as strictly defined by Sarah, said deviations, distractions, and dalliances are completely necessary in getting this fine vessel, the Discovery Class Starship Frontier, back home in one piece. I guess I'm still technically borrowing it from Constellation, even if I have no intention of actually giving it back. Gosh, do you think inventory will be on the bottom? New items. Oh yeah, that's just ammo. Artifact. Look at 
to me. Um, okay. Enhances reasoning and reflexes, improving problem solving skills. Quick slots. Yo, I'm way too used to freaking planescape. I thought like, I'm like, oh, where's the item descriptions? I'm a fucking fire axe. That's my description. <laughs> I'm just so used to like, and it'd be like a big, huge text or something, just saying like, <laughs> you know, where it was made from or etc. My personal modified maelstrom. Something about the menu. I don't know. I don't know. It's very simple, but too simple. Oh, thank God, you can have a play while exploring. Hey, yes, you can. Research station. Research lab lets you discover new crafting recipes by completing research projects. Project requires materials in order to progress. Of course, yes, we know how to fly. Pretty simple, you know? You just pull that lever there and just. Yeah. Oh, we're in space. Oh, wow. Now 
Now that we are in orbit, it might be wise to test all controls and systems to ensure they are not on the verge of, uh, of course. failure. I can step you through the entire process, or if you're already an experienced pilot, just power up all the systems and we'll be on our way. Hold left all to use was to switch between systems and allocate power. You can switch between system powering up all systems to clean the ground track. That's crazy. That's like freaking really dangerous. Uh -huh. I like the flying. It's fun. Let's go over the engines. Engines control our maximum speed. Try increasing and decreasing our relative velocity. A ship's engine has a sweet spot for better handling during turns. Draw your attention to the HUD. You'll notice a speed indicator in the lower left with a gauge that goes up and down as you adjust the throttle. Try to center the gauge so that it lines up with the center of the vertical bars to its right. Boosts can be engaged for temporary bursts of speed. Let's just have this speed. Oh, okay, alright. Let's turn our attention to the shields. Try adjusting power to the shields. Notice more power increases their strength. Shields protect the ship from hull damage. Without a hull, but be vaporized. Shield health is displayed in the lower right. Hull damage is below it. Oh, of course. We will need to disable their shields. Laser based weaponry is particularly effective. If you can keep the enemy ship centered on the HUD, we can log in to fire a homing missile. Oh. The enemy shields are down, Captain. Ballistic weaponry excels at damaging the hull. Shields are offline. Congratulations on surviving your first Starship assault, Captain. We should search the wreckage for spare parts and other salvage. You will need to fly close to it before we can access the remains. Because it's up to 22 speed. But if you hit W and S, mm -hmm. that lowers and fastens your speed. Yeah, yeah. If you keep it in the middle, Two you can turn. Ships are jumping into our location, Captain. Your ship will move, like, turn better. But if uh. you're at higher speeds, it it's harder to handle. Die. Oh. 
hostility has been far more than anticipated. At this rate, the odds of continual assault from their ships are high enough to jeopardize our mission. In short, they are after the frontier and will not stop. We will need to deal with the local Crimson Fleet captain. A recent scan indicates an abandoned facility on the nearby moon of Crete, a perfect staging area for pirates. So we're going to do the video. Zeus said, fuck that loot. <laughs> yeah, it's funny that you can like, just shoot it. <laughs> right. Do I just fly into it or what? You have to fly up to it and hit E. E. Like, does putting more power into lasers and missiles and ballistics do more damage, or like... Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe? You know what? Maybe it's not damage. Maybe you get more shots before it, it runs out. Because you can upgrade lasers later. Uh. So it's probably how many shots you get out of it. Or how quick it recharges. Seems like how quick it recharges. So if I could put it like... May depend on the ship, but right now it seems like it's how quick it recharges. The whole like changing the uh, putting power into different things makes me think just like uh really dangerous. Was it in travel to Crete? Alright. Planet view of the star map gives you information about the environment. Let's just scan the planet. Resources and loops you discover key landing sites. Take the planet until the Crete Research Lab icon. Oh, you don't land like I don't know. I was expecting freaking No Man's Sky. I don't know why. No, you you did not fly in the unfortunately. Dang. Well, at least, like, maybe a land button when looking at the planet would be nice, not just yeah. going into menu.
Captain, Protocol Indigo dictates that I am to return to the Lodge with no deviations. We are here to stop the Crimson Fleet from pursuit. Yeah, Nothing uh -huh. more. Why is this Crimson Fleet after Barrett? I have often asked Barrett that same question at various times and about various individuals that wanted to cause us harm. The most likely answer is that Barrett personally insulted him, typically by continuing to live, usually after escaping from certain death, and often with an object multiple people wanted. Constellation is an explorer's society founded over 50 years ago with the mission of seeking out the unknown. The Members unknown. often engage in expeditions in small groups, typically one or two people, or like Barrett and myself, one person and one robot. The membership is intentionally limited and small. Should you join Constellation yourself, you will be the 10th active member. That's a small amount of people in this constellation thing. I thought it would be like a giant, like, he just said it was only, I'd be only the 10th member. <laughs> what the heck? Why is Barrett dressing me with his shit? Barrett would say that billions of years ago, we were all one with the cosmos. So technically, you have known each other forever. But the more practical answer is likely that he needs you. The number of known people who have been affected by the artifacts is now two. Without your investment in Constellation's mission, he may never know more about the experience you both share. So he is showing you trust in order to gain your support. Yeah, I right, that's fair. How can I be of assistance? Hmm. Be careful, Captain. What? Alien creatures are often unpredictable. Can't tell me what to do. Scan creatures, minerals, and plants. Each unique item scan progresses. Pro progresses your survey data of the planet. Complete survey data. Scanner mode unlocks additional features such as building outposts and using social skills like diplomacy and intimidation. What the hell's that? Oh hell yeah, photo mode. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh oh, we just took a photo. Oh, well, space's photo. Oh my god. I keep thinking space is like to go up. <laughs> oh shoot, that's a that's a full full rotation too. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. Oh, 
No. Cancel. Fancy new game, yeah. It's the freaking Skyrim in space. Rhymes, how are you doing? Periodic table, shoot. Periodic table. Dust roof. Can't mine it. Oh, harvest. We just started. Discovered some weird artifact and some dudes like, hey yo, join my team. Cup. Yeah. -ha -ha. Oh shoot, let me pick it up. Oh, that's a dead dude. What do you got? Credits? Comic organic resource. This item can be used as component craft. And uh, for ten, whoa, crazy. There a quick save button. Oh, 
pirates. While I am programmed for combat. What? No, he's not nothing. We are no longer alone. I think you're right. That's freaking loud, man. Hold on, I don't lower this. Save on pause. Oh, when pausing the game after a specified time. Neat. No, wait. We did not have to do that. Did I? Got some something out of that. Rubar rhubarb flavored boom pop soda. And not pretend. Oh in a can. You got some pretend pretend I can do, that's pretty funky. That is literally fries in a can. Antibiotics. It's the same pistol. Yeah. No way. Not what I wanted. Don't talk to the animals, wear safety gloves, goggle, goggles, wear a lab coat, wear gloves when necessary, don't eat at your workstation. Alright. Whoa, something's out there. Something's out there. Uh, no? Yeah. Also, though, you met here pressing zero. You met here. Also, low. my health is already low. Oh, out of here.
Explode. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's pretty neat. Starware. Project Pet Shop. Have arrived in the morning. Surprise, as usual. This. What's the pause in a word? Incredible. So this is where it's natural species. Doesn't need these beasts obedient. Obedience pests. But we could just call them stalkers. Back here. Uh. Weapon case. Oh, syringe, medis. Screw it. <laughs> Let's grab everything. Oh, heck. Not another dead scientist. Slots, we have to open the lock. It's like the key. Oh, good luck with that. Oh yeah. I like how they do it. Oh, that's what the picks are for. Okay. Each key can be used once. Dang. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're probably not going to unlock this because you ran no. out of picks. Yeah. So what you can do, it right? So you have those three different circles. Uh-huh. You, you don't have to choose that first one, per se, right? Oh. You have, so you, ha you, it, you have to think ahead with these. Oh, and I didn't realize you could choose the other ones. Okay. Yes, you can choose the other ones. And then if you have to undo it, that's when it costs a digi pick. Mm. So it costs one to go in, and then it costs, it costs one to undo. each time you take them out to undo it. So you really have to plan if you want to unlock something. Because you have to like visually look at it. It's It's pretty interesting how they do it. Oh, 
Where are you? Where are you? Oh, let me reload. Nah, nah, you can't. You ain't running away. Prioritizing our deaths over your own survival. Back here. Desktop Digiframe. Fancy. Hell yeah, dude. They ain't a Bethesda game without being able to grab anything. <laughs> Out my way. Yummy. Up the stairs we go. All right, let's try this door again. How would I switch to a different one? You just click on it. Oh, cool. All right. I kind of wish that it showed them like all and just like dimmed out the ones. So like you could set them in place. Mm hmm. Fancy. Oh shoot, another one. Oh god. Uh.
Oh, ammo. Cool. We pick up for crafting, grenade, mine. I'm detecting a safe nearby. Uh -huh. You could make use of whatever is inside, provided you had some digit picks and a that? disregard for personal property rights. Look oh, lower. Oh yeah, ramen. Oh, well, I got any more freaking picks. Where'd that thing go? Heat leech. What? Common organic resources size and can be used component craft. Alright. Okay. Oh, I got. Modified Eon. Deep mining suit. Investigating web shake. Huh.
Invasion of Ipshank. Doubles what? Instigating Ripshank. What of? A wild name for a shank. How's it compared? Can I compare it to another one? Might as well just deal with that. What's your problem with Barrett anyway? We don't have a problem with Barrett. We want that ship, the Frontier. If you're the captain of it now, that means we're after you. Uh, that's right. I killed Barrett. Tell your pirate friends to back off. Oh no, you see. We weren't really after Barrett. We're after that ship. Every Crimson Fleet rook hears about the Frontier. That constellation keeps treasure hidden in the cargo bays. The loot from a hundred planets. That statement is partially correct. The frontier has been to many planets. And Wait, there's a lot of treasure on it. The only things held in the cargo bays are spare parts, dust, desiccated food particles, and a variety of species of ant. I don't care what kind of lies Barrett programmed that robot to say. We're taking that ship. No treasure in my ship. Cut your losses before more people get hurt. You're not talking us out of this score. To persuade a person you need to make a successful make a successful choice, the choices can range from kind words, distractions, and threats. The choice has a difficulty. The higher the difficulty, the greater the chance the choice fails. More but the more points you'll earn when succeed. You have a limited number of choices you can make, but you can never fail if your last choice succeeded. Oh. Huh. You have a wrong cons cons constellation is an explorer's group. They aren't treasure hunters. It's not wrong. That's it. Yeah. They aren't. You sure? Ship doesn't have anything on it. You're chasing a fairy tale. No, that, that can't be right. Why trade ships? All right, well, come aboard, front. Save yourself. There's nothing on it. You, you mean that, don't you? You really haven't found anything on board? No, we got nothing, dude. There was once a risk. Okay, I see. So it's pl and then it's like lower the chance the higher it is. There was once the risk to the worst happening. Nobody wants that. Can't believe this. There isn't any treasure. We've been trailing that old constellation ship for nothing. Get out hey, of here. Take your robot and your ship and get out of here. I see you all again. You're dead. We should now be free to travel to Constellation's headquarters without Crimson Fleet interference. We need to reach the Alpha Cent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, how you guys doing? Don't come back. Hey man, at least, uh, at least you guys made it to the ship, made it to your goal. 
Even though there was nothing on it, I guess. We got over here. So I have to open the scanner. Look for the map, I kind of hold it. Oh. Press E or it. Wait, let me, let me look around a bit more. Oh, look around! What's that? Staple gun. Captain, to reach the launch, we must jump to the planet Jemison in the Alpha Centauri system and then land in the city of New Atlantis. Got it. Don't worry, this will all become second nature before too long. be pretty wild. Oh, you can do it from the mission thing. Did not read that. No contraband on ship. Wait for scan. Starship Frontier. This is United Colonies Security. Yeah. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Scan complete. No contraband detected. You are cleared for landing at New Atlantis. Capital of the United Colonies was founded in 2156, the same year humans first reached Alpha Centauri and set on set down on the planet named Jemison. Guess. Protocol Indigo again? Everyone knows about this Protocol Indigo. And 
and he's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the Trade Authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. How much crest do I have? Or did you say I could sell things? The Trade Authority runs a vending kiosk next to my booth. It's just off to the side, near the ramp. Besides that, Jemison Mercantile is your closest shop if you're looking for a bit of everything. That's further in, past the security checkpoints. Let me see what you should. Uh, let me see what ships you have for sale. I'm sure you can find something you like. Oh. Ponder. We don't play Nido. Like to view and modify my ships. Sure. How about it? Ship builder allows you to fully design, modify, and paint your ship. Solar gauge to the right tells you where you New modules will appear. Lower gauge is at zero, for example. New modules will be placed in the center mass of the ship. Building a new ship module will cost ship credits. There's a flight check that will give you warnings errors if your design is invalid for any reason. Wow. Ain't that crazy. It'll only be in this spot. Like, if I were to, like, put it anywhere else. Yeah, here. Yeah. That's interesting. Pulse laser cannon missiles. Oh, I'll weapon one too. Interesting. I would try to viewport. It'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Alright. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Trade authority kiosk. Is 
assume I don't even need that. How much health do I have? You receive one skill point to spend. You receive one skill point to spend every time you level up. Your skill also unlocks a challenge. Complete the challenge, then spend a skill point to rank up the skill. Upper represents basic skills. Those below are locked until you have a the Uh huh. Nuance skill. Nuance ability to listen and discuss can often co accomplish more than simply shooting first and asking questions later. Interesting. I can assure you this unprovoked attack on a United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. For you, Bobby, that includes meeting your new foster parent. My parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Oh, uh, well... Of, of course, uh, that's sure possible. <laughs> uh, we'll just, uh, we'll just... <clears throat> Helena Chambers, ID SSCOM 1327HCHA. I was the station administrator. I'll need to report to MAST ASAP for a full debrief. My treatment thus far has been entirely unacceptable. Any authority you had was forfeit the moment House Varun Zealots breached the station's perimeter and you failed to initiate proper evacuation protocols. Thank you for your service. We'll find you a new position commensurate with your experience. And Mr. Bosch, let me just say how honored I am to meet you. By all accounts, you're the only reason anyone made it out of there alive. Well, just glad I still remembered my flight basics. It had been a while. So was shooting a gun. I read all about New Atlantis. So cool! Is it true that the Nat train goes 5,000 miles an hour? Or that citizens get special train. discounts? Or that the whole city... ...celebrates when it's your birthday? Mine's June 11th, by the way. My parents took me to Aquila City last week. It kind of smelled. But I don't smell anything here. Um, no, yes, no. And I will certainly mark June 11th on my calendar. As for Aquila City, well... The air purifiers here in New Atlantis are state of the art. Ugh, Aquila City. Oh, don't even get me started right, right. on those simpletons. Ugh, Don's Roost has the best food in the settled systems. Wouldn't want to live anywhere else. You will be scanned as you enter the city. Please keep moving. Keep moving. Right through the checkpoint. When, oh, when does it scan me? Okay. No bounty. You're clear. Enjoy your visit. Sergeant Yumi's looking for reliable people to help the guard. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all. Go to the lodge. Well, hello. You hear about the job by any chance? Jo a job. Officer over there can help you with any bounty issues. A job. Tell me about Part -time it. Part-time security officer. The position's very flexible. Uh, you can basically work whenever you're available. No pressure. 
We've had some gaps in the schedule lately. Macy's out on maternity leave, Jose's on loan to Sidonia. When it rains, it pours type of situation. So really, we just need someone to fill the void. Interested? Not right now. No, uh, thank you. I appreciate the interest. If you change your mind, please don't hesitate to come back. Have a good day. I am really in the middle of something. You you have Captain, to go everywhere I go. All right. You don't need to wear your helmet in here. You know that, right? All right. I only, only wear my freaking suit. So we're like nothing at all. Nice. Back again. Are you interested? Nah. No. Uh, thank you. Word of advice, steer clear of the well. The well. Oh my god. It'd be like a quicker way to go down. New Atlantis information. Welcome to New Atlantis. Welcome to the city of New Atlantis, capital of the new co of the uh, United Colonies of the for the many. The cell systems as a whole. You can stand now in the most tele technological, technologically advanced city human race has ever conceived and constructed. New Atlantis was founded in the year 2156, same year we first arrived in the Alpha Centauri star system. If you're a resident, you're already familiar with your fantastic home. If you're a visitor, you're honored guests of the United Colonies and will be treated as such. Courteous and prof professional security personnel. Right. So as you stroll the streets or take the net train to the city's different district, well, you're in, you are in the embrace of the United Colonies and couldn't be in better hands. Thanks. Was that it? Shared history. Corporate directory. Mast. It's impossible to visit New Atlantis and not notice the imposing structure that is mast. Much more than a building, mast also serves as the foundation of the United Colonies. There are the military, administrative, and scientific triumvirate. triumvirate and Verit works tirelessly to ensure continuing peace and prosperity for everyone under the UC's protection. This is New Atlantis Transit, or the NAT. It provides free transportation throughout the city. We can take it directly to the Mast District.
secured ATM bank. Steal. The lock is too difficult. Here a brew coffee. Although I have attempted an analysis several times, I simply cannot quantify humans' addiction to caffeine. It's really like pains, dude. Like a small decision, but they all add up over time and it's paralyzing. You can really stop and think about it. Buddy, it's coffee. Pick one, get out of the way, and let us get on with our lives. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Sure. Thanks for choosing Terra Brew. What can I get you? Hello, and welcome to Terra Brew. How may I serve you? I'd like to place an order. What's your favorite thing on the menu? Corporate policy requires me to state that everything Terra Brew offers is my favorite. Okay, well, all right. Certainly. Please take your time. Hell yeah. Let's get one of everything. Buy or sell 25 unique items. Who the hell are you? You have a name. Here one moment, gone the next. I tell you, Gyal. you must Gyal? cherish everything and everyone while they are here. You never know when you may lose them. It takes time to grieve. Your loss will get easier with time. No, I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you. I appreciate that. You see, I lost something invaluable. Lost it in a bet. Oh. You must know. It was one of my most prized items in my collection. Was it a keychain? It was a gem. Priceless, no doubt. And its beauty was blinding. Life seems a little less bright without it. That scoundrel George St. George has it in his possession now. And knowing that fills me with such envy and anger. Hey, all this over there lost a bet. You made it seem like someone died. Well, yes. A part of me died when I lost it. You've missed that badly. There has to be a way to get it back. I agree. I think I know just the thing. St. George, like myself, is a collector of trinkets and relics from Earth. I have in my possession a plate that I'm sure he won't be able to live without. Please, would you be my hero and go exchange the plate for the jewel? I'm sure it will work. All right. Why can't you do it yourself? Oh, God, no. I could never face him myself. I'd be sick just at the sight of him. St. George would never give the gem back if I went myself. Right, he there... would gain a smug satisfaction from declining the offer. Uh... Uh, we'll do it, but I guess we'll just not mention you, Fantastic. right? Fantastic. Here's the plate. Come back to me when you have the gem, and please don't drop it. Oh, where are my manners? My name is Guillaume, by the way. Guillaume. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. What if George re rejects the exchange? Are you sure the plate is enough? I can assure you, with near certainty, he won't decline. As much as I hate to say it, St. George and I are cut from the same cloth. We both adore relics from Earth, no matter how large or monetarily valuable they are. Well, why'd you put that gem in the so bed, not history. your plate? And that means a lot to us both. It pains me to part with the plate, but I happen to have a few others in my collection. If it means sacrificing one to get the gem back, I will.
Are you from the area? Yes. I've been blessed to call New Atlantis home. When I was a younger man, I would travel the settled systems with no home to call my own. I was a nomad, if you will. But out of all the places I've been, no place quite spoke to me like New Atlantis. The gem must mean a lot to you. It does. It was the first item I ever collected. The start of it all. I received that gem when I was a young, young man. To know that I foolishly wagered it. Threw it away. Ah, well, I won't make that mistake again. You're a gallery by trade. Ah, not by profession. I work out of the Valberg building. Gambling is a vice I've indulged since I was a young man. And I've amassed a great collection of trinkets and valuables from it. Alas, recently my luck has soured and my collection is dwindling by the day. But I can't stop, right? I can't just quit. Because what if my luck returns? Uh-huh. Absolutely, I'm sure your luck will return eventually. I'm glad you understand. Lady Luck can be a cruel mistress, but I'm sure she will smile upon me soon. What type of things do you collect? I collect all sorts. Gems, novelties, old earth trinkets, anything and everything that has some sort of value, monetary or otherwise. One of my favorite possessions is a fork that was used on earth. How amazing is that? It's just a fork. You'd be amazed what people will wager in a bet. I've won and lost some truly breathtaking things. My collection, as it stands, is quite valuable and substantial. It used to be more so, but my bad string of luck lately has affected it. Yeah, okay. Until next time. Some fancy mugs. Make the exchange. Get the ruby stuff to get on that side. Um, Jemison. Barrett enjoys this establishment. He frequently buys chocolate here, though I have informed him repeatedly. It is likely a significant contributing factor to his being overweight. Damn. You're just saying it how it is, I guess. Hi there. Thanks for stopping in. Feel free to look around. I can take care of transactions, and if you've got questions, just ask. I'd like to see what you have for sale. Oh, please, take a look. Base suits. Cheddar snack crackers. Wow. Plus ten percent go to recovery for three days. Granola mix eighty five. Plus twenty percent health for percent of health for ten seconds. Hey, 
Thanks. It's hard work, but it all pays off in the end. And I can't take all the credit. Gerhardt, my business partner, he does so much of the work. Oh, you're doing so much of the work here. You actually. If it weren't for him, I don't know where we'd be now. Freaking co own this. Thanks for coming in. The viewport. Hey there. Always nice to see a new face. First time in New Atlantis? Yeah. I didn't think it was that obvious. <laughs> oh boy. I didn't mean for you to take it personally. It's just something to say to customers. Break the ice. Know what I mean? <laughs> Listen. You just relax. Make yourself comfortable. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. That work for you, new guy? Let me know if there's anything I can get you. Yeah, yeah. Business seems to be booming for you. Yep. Spaceport traffic keeps me pretty busy. But just between you and me, I've got something in the works that'll change everything. A new drink that'll make this place famous. Galaxy-wide. Uh-huh. What was that? I have to give this a try. Depends on what's in it. No, I'll give you it a try. It, I guarantee. Only, I can't make you one right now. Don't have the ingredients. What do you need? I made a deal with a hauler to bring me some small samples of an ingredient I think will make all the difference. But it never showed up. Turns out the guy I hired was also hired by a few other folks. The kind of folks who ship less than legal cargo. Uh-huh. Security got wind, and the whole lot was impounded. Now they're just sitting on it, taking their sweet time like they always do. It's killing me. Where is the ship? You should go talk to security. See if you can get what's yours. I submitted all the paperwork, believe me. It won't amount to anything, but I did it. And really, I'm not even certain this is what I need to finish the recipe. I just, I think it is. I need to get my hands on that cargo. Why does it have an ominous tone to it? I mean, doing something about this won't exactly be on the straight and narrow, will it? Uh, it just sounds like you need help, a uh, helping hand. I really do. It's gonna keep me awake nights if I don't try. Before we say anything else, uh huh. I am in no way asking you to do anything that might violate any of the many, many laws in place here in New Atlantis or the larger United Colonies. This is just one friend talking to another friend, asking if maybe that friend yeah, could yeah, possibly yeah. find a way to get her important cargo out of the impound. What if we get out of it? Hypothetically, that were done in a less than 100% legal way? Well, that might not be the worst thing in the world. You, uh, with me on this? I'm in. Who do I need to kill? What? Come on, <laughs> no. I'm already uncomfortable with this whole thing. Don't go making jokes like that. Uh, go ahead. Seriously, yeah. can you help me with this or not? I'll do whatever I can. God, you have no idea what a relief this is. I'm obviously not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or something. I just figure there has to be a way to get what I need. No hostages. Well, there goes my idea. Yeah, this is hardly a life or death situation. Some lights breaking and entering at worst, right? Yeah, no, no one will get injured. I'm obviously not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or something. I just figure there has to be a way to get what I need. Yeah, yeah, okay. What have you tried already? 
Like I said, I submitted the usual security release forms. But because my cargo is tied up with a bunch of, again, totally unrelated illegal stuff, I don't expect the forms to matter. At all. I went and talked to an officer at the office, too. You, me. Sergeant, maybe? He was polite, but unhelpful. I declined to suggest that as their new slogan. New Atlanta security. Polite, but unhelpful. Truth in advertising, eh? Polite, but unhelpful. And your information. I know a few things, but not much. The cargo is being held down at the spaceport, not in the security office. Still, they use the same access Spaceport. Cards. If okay. you had one, it'd work. Where do you However, get one? why you would have a UC security access card is none of my business, of course. I'm sure I'm better off not knowing. Beyond that, the ship decks over there might also be able to get in. I don't know any of them, or I'd be talking to them instead of you. No offense. Hey, what do I get out of it? I'm not worried. I'm annoyed. Wait, are you saying I should be worried? No, of course not. It'll be fine. Totally fine. I, I trust you. Heard any good rumors lately? I hear there's some sort of citizens group trying to get the old Varun embassy torn down. When I first heard about it, I thought it was a bit extreme, but really, would you want to move into that place? Me neither. And it's not like they're ever coming back. House Varun, I mean. Well, at least not make nice and be all diplomatic. We all know how that went. All right. See you around. He picked a good day to drop by. Bartender's making him strong today. Simeon Van you in the town for business? Can't talk right now. Sorry. Didn't mean to bug you. Good to see you. It's a hunter. <laughs> Not used to people coming up to me. The suit usually scares them off. Pretty cool suit. <laughs> Although I guess that's my fault, isn't it? Where'd you get that suit anyway? I guess you could say I've mm. always had it. Once you've been all over, like I have, you might find yourself in something like this too. Oh, can I have one? Can I have your suit? It's a little intimidating. Well, yeah, well, I, I go all over. A little psychological warfare up front tends to make things easier. So you're saying you're a thug. <laughs> I guess maybe I am. Hell, I've been everything else in life. Why not add that to the list? I spend a lot of time in the fringes these days. God help you if you come across something someone wants. You'd think it was things like civilizations and factions that cause people to want to shoot each other. No, even without that. It's still winner take all. There's a whole philosophy behind that sentence, isn't there? Oh, you're on to me. As long as I'm the winner, that sounds fine yeah, by me. You got that right. Wait a second. I think I'm in danger of having a real conversation with someone for a change. <laughs> Better stop here. <laughs> I'm sure we'll see each other again. Surely. I'll see you around. self service bounty clearance. The trackers align self service bounty clearance kiosk. If you have a if you have bounty with anyone in the settled systems, don't worry. For a small convenience fee, we can clear that up for you. Our records indicate that you are not wanted by any faction within the settled systems at this time. Please visit, please visit us again should you need us. Mission board. Huh. You picked a good day to drop by. All right. Sorry. Didn't mean. The lodge is here in the city. Huh. 
Or let's go on that nat train. out in front of mast staring at trees sounds upset whatever it is can't be that bad right scientists by the tree Commercial district. Damage. Hmm. A diplomatic visa? You got to be kidding me. Invoice have a TV. Was that me? Yeah, okay. Where's security? Uh, I'd like to talk about some... something. Back again. Are you interested in the job, by any chance? Let me know if you have... Any... Oh, geez, gotta go all the way on that side. Isn't a good place for civilians to be hanging around. There are some oh, I'm just can help you with. I'm just here to pick up a uh, cargo. Got some cargo that wasn't founded. I need to access it. Yeah, I can't really just let you in there. I'm sure we can work something out. <sighs> I'm glad you understand the position I'm in here. So you're saying no, but if I annoy you enough, you'll say yes, eventually, right? <laughs> That's a good one. I understand. 
can't let everyone through. What was our rules? You're not getting through. I'm going to need Damn. you to clear out of here or else I'll have to call security. Oh, hi, whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch for the engine blast, will you? They'll pull you right over. Hey, try and be careful, okay? Don't want a ship landing on your head. Damn. Thanks for the freaking digit picks, dude. Open door. Hey, don't mind me. Package for Nisa. It's not nothing. CO2. You will be scanned as you enter the city. Please. Okay. Regaining CO2 when full, you, you will take damage instead. It's pretty wild. Hey there, new guy. I got your Good stuff. To see you again. Can I get you something? I have a present for you. Oh, no way. You really got it? Hell yeah, I did. I probably don't want to know what you did to get this, right? I mean, I want to know, but it's maybe better if I don't. No one died. I certainly hope not. This is a huge deal to me, but it's not worth either of us murdering over. We didn't kill nobody. Well, I can assure this will all be worth it in the end. Matter of fact, I'm going to let you have the first ever sample. Oh, hell yeah. On top of that, you get free drinks. Not not like unlimited oh. free drinks. But you want a little pick-me-up now and then? I got you covered. I need some time. Not to free drinks. Next. Unlimited. But this This was the difficult part, I think. Really? Thank you so much. Anytime. Okay, use a drink. Sure thing. What can I get you? Hundred percent damage resistance. Whoa! What the hell? Oh, espresso. Six plus carry capacity. Catch you later. Hey, who are you, Simeon Ben? It picked a good day to drop by. Bartender's making them strong today. You in uh, town for business? I'm just here for all the strong drinks you're talking about. Cheers. Nothing like a cold one after a long trip through the space lanes, if you ask me. Well, it seems like we have that in common. Personally, I'm here looking for work. I just quit my job as a weapon tester for Mask. Quit your job? Weapon tester? Oh, yeah. Plenty of us. There's a whole branch of Mass scientific wing called DRIP. 
That's dedicated to developing new weapons for the UC military. What kind of skills are you peddling? I'm billing myself as a weapons expert, sniper tech specifically. Most travelers like having someone on their crew who's good with firearms. <laughs> the settled systems are no picnic. Duh. Today's your lucky day. I'm looking for people to join my crew. Well, I'll be damned. What a coincidence. Working on a ship sounds perfect. I was hoping my next job would get me out of the city. What's your offer? Would you consider working for less than the standard rate? I'm a reasonable guy, but that's just too low. All right. Never mind. Do I need a shower or something? A day night cycle? Get darker? Wait, what's my next squash quest? Oh, it's completed stuff. Something so much yeah. to see, so much to learn. What brings you to I New Atlantis? Ah, the usual things, I suppose fame, fortune, power. <laughs> I'm only joking, of course. I've actually been fortunate to call New Atlantis home for many years. For a collector like myself, I do believe there's no better place in all the settled systems. I've been charmed to make the acquaintance of many fellow old Earth enthusiasts here in New Atlantis. And that is why I continue to stay. What do you do? <laughs> Me? Uh, why, to be frank, I don't do much. Not anymore, at least. And that suits me just fine. Yes. So you don't collect things I anymore. I now live to collect artifacts on Earth. You see, every artifact tells a story. Even spoons and forks, which most take for granted. People laugh at me when they see I collect old Earth spoons. But think about it, friend. Spoons change the course of history. Can you imagine life without them? I, yeah. I couldn't. Your own wants his gem back. You'd like to exchange for a plate. Oh, I wish there was a way, like, an option to not mention. A plate? Oh, my. As in a plate from Earth? Absolutely. Without question. Here, take the gem. <laughs> that Guillaume, if he wanted his gem back so badly, he could have simply asked. You're scared. The gem is worthless. Less than a paperweight. But actually... Earth paperweights are quite valuable. Really? It seems like there's a lot of animosity between you and Guillaume. Bah, I'm sure Guillaume makes it seem that way. In reality, it couldn't be further from the truth. Guillaume and I have known each other for years. Since we were both young men, he is the closest <gasps> thing I have to a brother. And much like brothers, we quarrel. But that doesn't mean we don't like each other. I will say, however, Guillaume can be a tad over dramatic, as well as a sore loser. Don't tell him I said that. All right.
Go back to the frontier. Exit the ship. Temperature, 21%. Yo, what's that? A robot? Sanitation minibar. Be a way to go up and down, dude. the frickin coffee beans what's over here the well's been having brown on us all the time mast finally sent someone down there but nothing's changed the well he's getting brown out in the well I'm gonna grab lunch, we'll lurk. Alright, rhymes, have a good lurk, have a good lunch. So well. What's the well? Oh, slums area, huh? Kiosk. Nothing about the well. Yeah. Never a dull day for security in the well. Did you? Oh, hello. Who are you? Dang, I can't even talk to him. Use the security well key. be free. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. He's just walking away. All right. It's 
it's FOV, man. It's gonna make me vomit. Pardon? I help out Henrik from time nice. to time. Not very often these days. But that's fine. What is happening? If you're looking for a tracker, you've come to the right place. If not, well, you... I've got nothing. Hey, where are you going? Uh -huh. Follow our motto. Show no mercy, leave no quarter. I want to check if there's a bounty on my head. On you? That's news to me. Although I have heard about someone paying bounty hunters to get rid of a few special targets. Let's see. Yep, it looks like that's you. My condolences. Hey, what? Still, that's got to be a mistake. I can clear this up for you if you're willing to part with some creds to grease the wheels. Three thousand creds ought to do it. Three thousand. Oh, it was a wanted tree. Oh no, never mind. All right. Let me know if you change your mind. What's the Trackers Alliance? We are, quite simply, an alliance of bounty hunters. Some of us share resources. Some of us go it alone. But the organization makes it easier for us to do our jobs and legitimizes our work so that rather than being paid vigilantes, we are part of the system. Various people approach the Alliance looking for those living on the land. We use our unique skills to find and deal with them. All right. Uh, no. It's dangerous out there. Watch your back. What was going on? Why was that? They were like running? Oh, they stole something from me. No lawyering, okay? I don't have the patience for it. I can't say I'll have what you need, but you're welcome to look. Let's see what you got for sale. Yep, you got it. Got. Did you picks? Yeah. Right. Treats a brain injury, concussion. Remember. I'm surprised to find an electronic shop in the well. That's so. I think folks down here are too poor to afford electronics. No, no, no. I was just not the first time I heard that line. Yeah, I get that kind of attitude far too often. You find yourself with any more commentary, feel free to keep it to yourself. Let's try. I know what this place is. Oh, that's so. Well, then I'm hardly the man you want to be talking with. Take care. Don't mind me. Just it's a quaint shop. What do you do here? Oh, Henrik is an old friend of mine. I help out around here from time to time. But I don't just loiter around. I'm involved in my own business endeavor as well. I'd like to do business with you. Unfortunately, I'm quite old fashioned. I only deal with associates that I know and trust. But if you do a small favor for me, I might feel comfortable opening my business up to you. All you need to do is pick up a package from Red Mile and deliver it to me. You don't even need to interact with anyone. Uh, it seems shady. 
what's in the package? The contents are of no interest to you. And they're not contraband, if that's what you're wondering. If you're uncomfortable doing this favor, you're free to decline. All right, what even is your business? Ah, I'm not at liberty to discuss that yet. But I assure you... You freaking sell I body do. parts? What do you do? Sure, I'll do it. Fantastic. I eagerly await your return. Stay out of trouble. Joke, say those Varun zealots worship a snake. But let me tell you, it ain't a snake, it's some kind of celestial being. They call it the Great Serpent. What is it real? Hell if I know, but they think it is, and that makes them dangerous. Private sector, now that's where the real money's at. You see, surplus. Hey, what you got? I got contacts all over. Stock may not be so reliable, but I got ways of hitting things. Antonio Bianchi. Me, the real Bianchi, Bianchi. All that stuff topside. It's kind of fake. How do you like living in the well? A lot of people will tell you it's the worst. One step above being homeless. They'll whine about how folks topside have it so much better. Me? I like it. More real down here. Topside, everyone's trying to show how civilized and rich they are. Oh, it's exhausting. But hey, to each their own. Let's see what you've got. Absolutely. Need something else? I'll be here. What you got in here? Will they will they be angry if I do this? Happy to make a deal. You need to look around. You tell me. You see, it's a big organization. A lot of planets, a lot of people, a whole lot to keep track of. Sometimes they don't do such a good job of that. Sometimes stuff falls through the cracks, winds up collecting dust in some warehouse. But that's all right, because I, and by extension you, get to benefit. I make great deals on stuff in bulk, you get some low prices. Everyone wins. Mm -hmm. Watch your back out there. The well. All right. So I need to go. Let's go buy the coffee shop. Hey there.
Wait, what is this waterfall? What? Tony Cow. It's nothing like an afternoon off. I think I could live on coffee if I had to. Where's your day going? Uh, fine, I guess. Do we know each other? No. Making small talk. Oh, all right. <laughs> I thought you were trying to flirt with me. My day's going fine. It's hard to complain about anything when you have a terror brew in your hand. Catch you later, yeah? How do you live around here? Or do you live around here? What, at Terror Brew? I wish. <laughs> nah, I, I live at Athena Tower. Just moved in, actually. My girlfriend and I got a place there a few weeks ago. What do you do? Not sure how long we'll be there, though. We're saving up to get out of New Atlantis and uh, tour the settled systems. And what about your girlfriend? Yeah, sure. Her name's Donna. She works at the Nat Station near Mast. Oh, boy, is she a catch. She's passionate, beautiful, friendly. I really lucked out. We met a couple of years ago, and uh, we've been going steady since then. I'm actually thinking about asking her to marry me pretty soon. Uh, keep that between us, okay? I don't want her finding out before I pop the question. Before or after you guys move? Catch All right, you later, see you, dude. Yeah. Fall damage? Will I die from this? From such a height is dangerous Affliction. Open the status tab. In your status. Open the status menu. Tab in the status menu. You have an affliction. Take the correspond remedy to cure it. Okay, oh my god, it's Metal Gear. Right. And look for a, a match. Uh, yeah. Sprain. Taking use O2. Interesting. Terror brew day. Telling them I am a that manager. George I Saint George. Managing. How many? Here's your gem. Ah, wonderful. I knew George would make the exchange. He could never resist foodware from Earth. You was with the gem. A great service today, friend. I'll be sure to never take this gem for granted ever again. Thank you for bringing it back to me. Ta-ta. Level three. Whoa. Two skill points. Med packs, trauma packs, and emergency kits. Ten percent. Craft special specialty specialty food and drinks. All right.
I had to stealth meter. You were 25% more difficult. Ballistics. Dueling. Has optional zoom to hand scanner. You attempt to hack advanced locks. We can here. That's all we can ever do. Strange place for a medical clinic, isn't it? Funny story about that. You know, when people first arrived on Jemison, they dismantled the colony ship and used the parts to establish a place to live. Over time, they built out and up and up, and after long enough, they started to forget about the people and the things till down here. The walls and the ceiling have changed, but this place still uses equipment from that old ship. And it's here because not everyone in New Atlantis can afford Reliant Medical. You run this place all by yourself. Don't have much of a choice. Can't afford to pay staff and while I've got a few volunteers from the community, I can only ask so much of them. We've scraped by for a good long while now and we'll continue to do so. Don't you worry. Could use some medical supplies. We're no reliant medical down here, but if you've got credits, I might have something for you. Increase fusion and alterations and puncture wounds. Suppresses addiction symptoms. What? Pencil and X. Large body of infection used for treating afflictions. Treats a brain injury, concussion, heat stroke. Heal pace. Treats burns and frostbite. I need help, Doc. Okay. What seems to be the problem? Oof, it's a damn good thing you came in. You're a right mess. Yeah. Five hundred. No, I never mind. Right then, consider it never minded. You have an item I can cure an affliction you're currently suffering from for the alien status. Oh shoot. You know Reckling would use it. Mobilizer. Sprain cured. Three gunshot. I'm not exactly How's the field of stars, yo, best? How are you doing? Uh, it go, it go. Um, it's pretty neat. Oh, how we're only what three hours in, and 
kind of still re like really in the beginning. I've just been exploring stuff. Three hours in, one hour of just creating the character. Wait, where the hell? Where are we? As, as you should, yeah, you know? An hour of creating a character that you're, you're never gonna see. That's how it be in games, right? Go to large mast district. Where are we? Talk to Sergeant Yumi. Menu system just feels weird in this game. I don't know. The water is quite aesthetically pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. It's not where Sergeant Yumi is? That's a spaceport. Hope you're doing well, Bez. Oh, wait. That's the freaking. I already talked to him. Did it say why? No. Scientist by the tree. And they good? That's good to hear. That is a good to hear. Having a good one? You also have a new new vid. On oh what the heck? Vid? Vids? Is it not? Oh is it vids? A new short slash TikTok. Buddies and I are reacting to uh already stowed. Twilight, we watched Twilight. Man, that's a what a wild movie series that is. Oh my god. I swim. Apply for a job at How am I talking to scientists? What is happening? Mast district. All right, scientists, but you, what are you doing, Kelton? I'm sorry. I really can't afford to be distracted. I need to get to the bottom of this. Of what? What are you doing? You seem to be staring at a tree. I am not staring. I am analyzing. This is important xenobiological work. I work for the scientific division of MAST. I've been studying this tree for quite some time, and it appears to be exhibiting some worrying signs. What kind of signs? Are you familiar with this particular specimen? Do you understand its importance? No. Look, I have a lot of work to do here. If you're just going to gawk, I'd ask that you move on. If you can actually assist me, however, I would appreciate it. I don't we need help with solicit help from random passersby, but it seems an exception is necessary. Would you be willing to retrieve some additional data for me? Uh, something in it for me. A mercenary, huh? Well, I'm sure we can work something out. So, are you on board? Yeah, why not? Well, that's... Thank you. 
That's unexpected. Ah, there's a series of biosensors I've placed in various locations around New Atlantis, all calibrated to gather pertinent information. They've been running for long enough that I think it's time to collect and analyze their findings. If you would bring them to me, that would save time. Oh, Jesus. Is it all around New Atlantis or just this one district? So you can only fast travel if you discover the area. It's fair. A tree grows in New Atlantis. Hello. Hey, are you looking for eggs too? I've only huh? found one so far, but I want to find more before anyone else does. So if you see some, can you tell me? Uh... Egg you found wasn't beeping, was it? Yeah, it was. Weird, right? I need it. Miss Seng over at UC Distribution bought the one I found, and she said she might buy more if I can find them. I could really use the credits. Hey, I'll buy it. When I grow up, I'm gonna be a free star ranger. UC distribution. Uh oh. I'm afraid, due to recent legislative action, I'm no longer able to allocate ships. I can, however, deal in general goods. Welcome to UC distribution. Now, before you say a word, I am required to inform you that formal complaints cannot be filed until the customer feedback system is back online. I have been told it'll be up and running in two weeks, but you know how these things are. I am sorry for any potential inconvenience. Also, if you're here about a corporate account, I've been assured that deliveries will be back on schedule soon. You bought an egg from a kid recently? I need it. Who, Jordan? <laughs> that kid's in here every other day with some random thing he found. Trying to get credits. Yeah, I took pity on him. I'll buy it off you. Why, what is it? Just some junk I dropped the other day. That's so? Must mean something to you if you came looking for it. Well, you can have it back for what I paid for it. Plus, a little extra. Let's call it a convenience fee, shall we? Convenience fee? Had you just give it to me? I could, but I did pay for it. I'd like to recover my losses. That's fair. It's all the way in the back room. I'd have to walk back there, then back out here. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Junk. If that's true, why bother coming back for it at all? I uh, forget, I forget it. Suit yourself. That freaking smug face. I hope we have what you need. Average retail worker. What does he do here? You mean besides providing a pleasant face for customers to interact with? It's all in the name. We distribute materials and products all around the United Colonies. Never a dull moment. Always something going on and for other things we need to be ready for. I know some people don't believe it, but we really do the best we can. Wouldn't still be working here if I didn't care. All right. Back to it then. I've met so many interesting people from working at the distribution center. I would just take your freaking thing. You my 100 credits. Screw you. Nah. -uh. Alright, that's one of them.
I once went to check on the back of the store for a customer. No, we didn't have the stuff. Went to the break room and ate a snack instead. That's good. That's classy. Apply for a job. A kiosk. Investigate brownouts in the well. There's no other way to get to the well. I got hey. you. Oh, you're not Garl. Sorry, I shouldn't assume. Maybe you go by Garl. You're just not the Garl I was waiting for. We're supposed to be investigating a power drain. Yeah, I'll be Carl. We're, we're willing for. Brownouts for a while. Kept hearing mixed reviews for this game, so I don't know what to believe. <laughs> I can't be in two places at once, and Garl isn't here, so I'm just trying to look inconspicuous. Seems all right so far. Nothing bad. Uh, who's Carl? Co-worker of mine on this assignment with me. Clearly not taking it seriously. Not really surprising. Most folks are fine with ignoring... Uh, what, one, here. one thing that I really do not like, and I'm I'm going to freaking puke playing it, this, is uh, no FOV changing. I should be able to change my FOV even on the console command. You can't do it, so I need to download a mod for that. What exactly are you investigating? We're trying to isolate a power drain, which looks like it's the result of a large amount of power being rerouted through various subsystems. But it's kind of a two-person job. Someone needs to find the junction boxes associated with those subsystems and power them down. The other person needs to monitor the system remotely. It's pretty simple, really, and relatively safe. Only a small chance of electrocution. Okay, well, there's a medical bay right there, so I should be fine. I could assist well, you. Since you're here and Carl isn't, and I really want to get this yo, solved, yo, I'll pick you up on that. What I need is very No, no FOV I slider. Where's my FOV? I'm head to the monitoring station. The first box we're looking for is over near UC Surplus. You know, Antonio's place. I can contact you once you get there. Yeah, all right. Okay, junction box. Yeah. I think this is working. I think it's working. Things, the lock picking system is pretty neat in this game. That's what I, I, I like. You find it, open it up and flip the big switch. That's it. I did it. Great job. Easy. So that tripped the secondary breaker, and that goes to Oh wow, really? They wired it like that? Jeez. Okay. Okay, got it. Next one is way down past Jake's. And maybe up a story or two? It's a bit of a hike. Sorry. Oh, you got this. What is this? Panel doors. Requires computer. What's a computer? Is that to carry a computer around with me? 
Oh, wait. I don't want to take freaking fall damage. I want to break my ankles. Not risking that. Yeah. You should be near the next the is too zoomed in. This is not very much these days. So many 90. To see. I don't think this is 90. Even if it's, even if it was 90, it's not it's not wide enough for me. That's the one. Next one's not too far. Dead end. Right down from Jake's. Right under that apartment. Wait. Let's see. Uh Bing Bang. Get that one. Uh Yeah. Uh. Yeah, that should work. Good luck with that, right? Whoa! Oh shoot! What the hell is that? Big Bruno! Mm -mm. Out of here. Ow. Why is a centered magnet? I maybe I'm just too used to freaking Planescape for like the last couple of weeks. Cause I'm like, I go to my inventory and I keep expecting like every item to just have descriptions on them. But not every item does. What's the biosensor? Mobilizer. Common manufacturer component. This item can be used as a component in crafting. I do like the, the new item thing you have. Chunks cheese steak. Credits. Hard plus med pack. Milk. Modified rattler. Ski. Like the vacuum sealed spacey stuff. Are we carrying too much? No. I wish there was a way to. It says compare to equip. I want to be able to compare between like two different items. I mean, I guess that does do that if I click on it and equip. Uh, yeah, modified router, let's do that. It's like a stronger pistol. Desktop digiframe. Credits. Dark can. Yeah, why not? Space trucker hat. That's pretty neat. I don't really want it. I grabbed it anyways, I guess. Toilet paper. Plunger. Anything else you have in here? Well, dinner plate and this rag. Portable desk fan.
you have shootouts in zero G? Uh, I don't know. I've only played like the beginning. This is like the f complete beginning, where the tutorial is basically just go to this planet, fight some baddies, and that was it. And now we're here, and it's like continue the story. I should probably continue the story eventually. The uh, the flight, um, the flying in space gives me like really dangerous vibes. Cause you can uh, you can source where you want to put your power going to, whether it's like lasers or shield or uh, engine. Yeah, alright, all right. go, go over there. Can I go here? What is this? Evening, sir. Evening. Where the are trade you? authority has access to goods and services no one else does. No one. Welcome to the trade authority. If you're here on legitimate business, I would be more than happy to help you. If, however, you are here under false pretense, say, sent by one Miss Tsang of UC Distribution, then I'm afraid Who? you'll find nothing illegitimate here to report to her. And I'd ask that you pass along my request to stop these silly games. So, what'll it be? Curses, you've blown my cover. <laughs> no one she's sent so far has had any hint of a sense of humor. So either she's getting craftier, or you're not working for her. Please, let me know if I can assist you further. What a salesperson, yeah. Uh, why are you way down here in the well? We've been in New Atlantis for a very long time. Before most things topside were built. With lots of infrastructure already in place, ample storage, and discreet access to the spaceport. It makes sense to stay. It's had the unintentional, but not unwelcome, side effect of weeding out people who can be... Timid about doing business. Oh, all right. What do you have for Be sale? Same old, same old. Don't really need to buy anything. All right, now at least. It's above. We even get there. Let's follow the. Uh, Okay. Hello. Let's follow. What? This is the story with the robot dude. This is Vasco. He is uh, our partner for, I guess, the remainder of our mission so far. Like uh, I don't know if you want the like the full the full plot so far. It's really just like the first hour of the game is where I am in terms of story. Robot that works for Barrett. Barrett is part of a uh, faction organization society called the Constellations. A group of people that have been. Uh, members of the society for over 50 years of people who just, I guess, interact with some wild artifact and they trip balls. Okay. The final box I need you to deal with should be right around there. In a computer. I just realized you're in for a real angle of gabling. Like 200 years of Bill attempts to rewire things. I tried to fix it three years back and was crying by the second day. Gave up on the third. Anyway. There should be a series of secondary breakers you need to deal with before you can access the junction box. I don't remember the order, but flip levers until all those circuits oh, are powered Oh, I don't mind down. if I do. Alright, flip, flip, flipping some powers, flipping some boopity bop. Oh. Did it. Easy. Wow, you got it. Really well done. You saved me like a week of work. Why didn't you meet 
meet me at the monitoring station near where we met. You know, the usual plot. Protagonist interacts with special item. Becomes... Oh no, random nobody... Uh, interacts with special item. Becomes protagonist. I just wanted to continue mine, dude. I was... I was a diplomat. I just became a miner. Some good old rock and stone. Where, where, where am I going? O2 if you run too much, but then... So I like how the stamina thing works so far. That white bar at the bottom left is our O2. And if we go past it, we get CO2. If we reach all the way, we start taking damage. Pretty neat. Alright, I did the freaking junction boxes. Did I say thank you? Because thank you. There's no way I could have done that in a reasonable amount of time all by myself. I wonder if we just made things worse. Maybe in the short term, but overall it paid off. Thanks to your help, I was able to trace the power drain. I know where it's coming from. Oh yeah? Unfortunately, the source is exactly where I was afraid it was. The trade authority. Oh, we were just there. So that's something that I'll need to deal with. That'll be fun. You want me to deal with it? If you want to tag along, I certainly wouldn't complain. But if not, then this is where we part ways. All right. Oh, like another mission. All right, now. A lot of people recommend installing this game on SSD and not a hard drive. On a computer, at least. Some people say it literally does not run if it's on a hard drive. I mean, like a buddy of mine. He did not run on his computer when he installed it on his hard drive back soon. And not on, not on an SSD. Weird? Nah, it's just like... How much things are loaded in and how fast they load in. I, I think that's like the kind of the norm nowadays, right? For video games. I know, like... Ratchet and Clank, you need a fast SSD uh, on a PC, or else, or else the parts where you're like uh, shifting through different uh, dimensions or something, different worlds, is uh, very slow on a regular hard drive. All right, we'll go to the lodge. Probably gonna get on console. That's a good idea. Mast, the military, administrative, and scientific triumvirate. It stands as a symbol of the United Colonies. Have we got the mast? Where are we? Take the. Blah. Take the nat train. Well, I guess we are here. Never mind. <laughs> um, mega. Good old F5 for quick save.
We may be in a United Colonies city. Uh -huh. But Constellation is an entirely neutral entity and always has been. Here we are, the lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. All right. Oh, I can't name it. <laughs> oh my god, I keep sneezing. What? Captain, bless you. Thank you. Thank you. In the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. This is literally a lodge. I thought it would be like, you know, I thought it'd be called the lodge because like pretty cool scientific nickname or something. This way, Captain. Hello. Housekeeping. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? I don't know, man. He would just, like, take my ship. Pirates attack. Barrett asked me to deliver the artifact. I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. Hey, man. And if we hadn't insisted on installing rock and those stone. emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Mateo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? I trip balls is what happened. How many times has this happened? Who else had these visions? We think it's anyone else who pulls one out of the rock for the first time. Why? We're not sure yet. So if you wouldn't mind adding another data point. Oh, it was bright lights and music. Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience. With less embellishment. There. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, Conjure, if you expect us to believe in fairy. If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But why? Why are we getting visions? Can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. What? Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. I think it will end disaster. We already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have, the artifact. If you could place it on the table here. Hmm. I don't know about that. What if we actually like blow up the planet? Sprinkle on LSD. All right. Okay. Here we go. Please. We need to analyze what oh, you found. Yeah, Sorry, there isn't yeah, okay, time. Okay, for okay, okay. Introductions, but All right. We see the artifact, just like the others. And to imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh snap! They're doing oh, something. God, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves. Easy, girl. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Okay. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Godfrey? You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting. Now, would it? 
Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend here? What? <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? No. You want me in Constellation? What does that mean? What's expected? We're all here because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. I don't know, man. Beyond that, I was a former diplomat. To I, I, judgment, to become like a the rest of us. working in a mine. I, I don't know if I need this, you know? How much do you know about the artifacts? What are they? Individually, they're just odd hunks of metal. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. As to what they are, what they're building, well... You'll be part of solving that puzzle now. Space magic. Got it. All right, I'm in. Tell me what happens next. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. So everyone has interacted with a freaking rock? Together. Get your feet wet. And here, I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. Money? In addition to credits, nice. Why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Boost. Just mind your head. Oh. All right. I kind of want to get some. Or, or where are the, uh, go get some stealth. Hides a stealth meter. You are 25% more difficult to detect when sneaking. Suppressed weapons do an additional 5%. Complete the previous rank challenge. Form 10 sneak attacks. Succeed th in three speech challenges. So that's interesting. To get uh, to unlock the next rank, you have to do a challenge. It's not that hard. Buy or sell twenty five. Buy for five percent less and sell for ten percent more. Considering the popularity of personal side arms, settled systems. Pistols do ten percent more damage. <laughs> I'm slowly just doing like the freaking same build I did in Cyberpunk. I hope Barrett makes it back to us. I know he gets into trouble all the time and everyone just sort of accepts he'll be fine, but still. That was intense, wasn't it? Well, that was intense. Facts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. Very. A lot overwhelming now that I think about it. I'm Noelle. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. Anytime. That's so Nova Tomb. <laughs> dude, I can't wait for... Oh my god, I can't wait for... Freaking Cyberpunk, dude. Oh my god. I remember... I remember when I played Cyberpunk last year. Like, I actually play, fully played through. I bought Cyberpunk day one. Or I even pre-ordered it. But my computer at the time really couldn't handle it. So when I finally upgraded my PC and played through Zarbunk, I'm like, man, this is, a, this is a fun, that was a fun game. I enjoyed everything about that. I wanted to replay it. Not replay it. I wanted to get all the other endings and stuff. I never did. Everything all right. Maybe I'll do that before uh, the DLC comes out. I got Corpo ending. And I looked at all the other endings, I'm like, eh. 
I kind of dig the Corpo one. That I like my character just going crazy. How long have you been working on all this? Well, Constellation's been around forever, more than 50 years now. But we only became aware of the artifacts recently. Barrett discovered the first one about two I don't Stadia, but then that service died and, and never got to finish. Got no, emotion. Stadia, I didn't even know it was it's on a Stadia. Shame he isn't here to see this. That's wild. Yeah, rest in peace, Stadia. It had potential, but then there were just other services. Even You're like quiet. Game Pass. Is it Game Pass Ultimate? Now has their own cloud based system. Or like I remember Parsec. I don't know if Parsec still does it, but I remember I remember Parsec you could rent servers and just play off of that as well. <clears throat> But then Stadia, Stadia had it was its own platform, right? So that that was the thing. I remember when it came in, I was like, a lot of people were thinking, "Well, what happens if Stadia ever shuts down?" And then it happened. Big unfortunate. The vision I saw. What do you think that was? Oh right, that. If we we're approaching this rationally. I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. It's trip balls, I get it. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neural input. Your brain's attempt to make sense of something. An energy surge, some other phenomenon. I got a mass effect, I get it. Barrett saw something too. He did. At the time, well, it's Barrett. We weren't sure if he was kidding around. Clearly, he wasn't. So did all of you experience this? So there's a reasonable explanation. There might be a reasonable explanation. I wasn't there. I didn't see what you saw. I'm just not in a position to say for sure. That's okay. Now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? You seem to know a lot about these artifacts. Oh, gosh. No, I mean, that's that's flattering. But really, we're making this up as we go. Until you that's arrived, fair. we only had the two. And the vaguest sense that there was something more at work. There's still so much we don't know. And that means a lot of work ahead of us. Is there something about a place for me to stay? Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Right. True. So you've I seen the library, wrong, obviously. I'm told, Walter's I'm not quite here. proud I'm of the collection, what I might be but Matteo has made more than a few contributions. Walter Matteo. Gardens are out the doors Noel, there. Sarah. If you need a moment of quiet contemplation. Emphasis on the quiet part. The At least you There was a story about a guy who had a crazy amount of hours in Red Dead 2 and was begging to transfer to another platform. Oh, I think I remember hearing about that. It was a big to do at the time, but most people in the city have forgotten. Crazy it. amount of hours. Oh, I have a, I have a key now? Oh, alright. She she doing a tour or what's happening? Oh, I'm loving this. Walk faster. So this is the bar. Usually no tender, so help yourself within reason, of course. Now let's see about that room. Where the drinks at? Just drink all the we stock. Almost at max occupancy already, but there's still one room up for grabs. It's been nice having the place so full. Oh, 
Okay, this will be you. Common room on one side, so that'll be quiet. And Mateo on the other side, so maybe a little less quiet. I'm sure Sarah has something planned for each of us, so... I'll get that. I'll get that, okay. I did not pay attention to my room. Yeah, all right. This is a fancy freaking place. Who owns this place? I'm going to assume that that Walter dude, he he seemed rich. Why did why did I pick up a case? Ah. I like this, uh, accessible. The scanning thing. I feel like every, no, I feel like every game, if items are hard to look at in your first person game, you need like a scanning thing. Just so like, Let's see what the heck is interactable, you know? Maybe not every game. That's the frontier. Some fancy stuff. That ball. What? Game piece. Snow Lord. Isn't that just cricket? Yeah, I was. They do look like old Earth baseball. It's not Daggerfall in space. It's not. So how are you doing, Dex? Star locked. Can you settle this? Settled systems. Starting out my space adventure as well. Hell yeah. It's a. Uh, it's all right so far. I mean, I'm only in the beginning still. Why were your thoughts so far, Dex? Or Sarah. Can I help? All right. All right. To be honest, how about yours? It's all right. It is it is all right. So, are you ready to get to work, or was there something else? Ah. Uh, hold up. Bye for now. Let me talk to you. <laughs> Well, I suppose that station in orbit has more than. Want to try this a little later on? Point. Really glitched well, to get a. I suppose calling you a decent armor early. Really? A bit out of line. It's pretty wild. Huh. That was an apology. You can do better. I've been called worse. Still doesn't excuse it. My frustrations lie more with Barrett. Not I don't know why Barrett. Not the first time his shenanigans have jeopardized one of our ventures. Where the heck is Barrett? Barrett is fair of me to take it out gonna on betray you, us. Especially since it would seem he made the right call this time. So, let's start over. Right call this we? time. 
well, to make Stroud, it sound like there have been of Stroud Eklund, moments where the wasn't the right call. Off times, grumpy old man. Welcome aboard. Hope the drinks are at least free. Yes, well, a stock bar is a treat I think Constellation can afford. For now. But if you clean us out, you're on your own. By the way, in addition to a place to stay, the Lodge has a wealth of modification and research equipment. Spacesuit customization, pharmaceutical manufacturing, <laughs> testing alien substances, the whole thing. You can even fashion industrial pieces for large-scale projects. If you don't mind extracting a few raw resources from a nearby planet, that is. I'm a fan of self-reliance, so I encourage you to make use of the tools we have to build what you need. Do you think the vision I had means anything? Up until very recently, I'd likely have dismissed <clears throat> it as, I don't know, hallucinations. But now... I'm not sure what. To Who's say. tripping balls, dude? I don't suppose you have a it's history of this sort of thing. Space, space LSD. Hmm. Mm -mm. I see lights and hear music all the time. It's a non-stop party in my head. Well, clearly the sarcasm center of your brain is intact. I'm no scientist. I leave that to the likes of Barrett and Young Noel there. But I think we can all agree there's something unusual going on here. Space magic, man. Frankly, this is the most exciting thing that's happened in years. Actually, still in that cave, you never left. This was all it. Oh my god, imagine. You wake up. A game, a, the game ends. You wake up. It was all a dream. Dude, speaking of all, all dreams. Oh my god. Oh my god, freaking Twilight. Twilight. Freaking. I don't know if I'll ever have a movie experience like those movies ever again. This isn't where I expect a CEO. Funny thing about companies, you build one sturdy enough, it doesn't need you there all the time to prop it up. Stroud Eklund functions quite well on a day-to-day -day basis, leaving me time to devote to more esoteric pursuits. For years, I was captivated by the writings of Constellation's founder, Sebastian Banks. Where he at? I finally decided to do something more than admire from a distance, and so now I call the Lodge home as much as anywhere else. What kind of company is Stroud Eklund? The most well known for ship manufacture. No expense spared. If you want the best and can afford it, you choose Stroud Eklund. Unfortunately, our success means you'll sometimes see Stroud Eklund ship modules on less than reputable vessels. They covet them. The bastards. I've tried to convince the United Colonies we can help in that regard, but they're married to Deimos Star Yards, and those old salts are stuck in the glory days. What's your role in Constellation? Me? <laughs> Why, I'm the wallet. Someone has to fund all this, and all my Dude, success that, that doesn't mean much if I can't the money. put it to good use. I don't pretend to have the daring of Ms. Morgan or the smarts of young Mateo, but I can make sure that they have the resources they need. And as you've now seen, those resources aren't being wasted. We're onto something big here. Yeah. I Remember, you're representing all of us out there. I feel like I've been waiting my whole life for this. Constellation, the artifacts. That doesn't sound crazy, does it? Yeah, it does. Are you doing okay? I'm not sure anyone really asked yet. Don't want you to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else. You matter too. You've done something really significant bringing that artifact here. I'm Mateo. Theological scholar by trade, but now, well, an explorer like you. It's really good to have you with us. Of course. I have been given These artifacts all came out of caves? Second one was on Kazal, buried the same as the one you found. But the I'm surprised no one just like has it. Noses for years, sitting in storage, masquerading as an oversized paperweight. Uh huh. 
Can you imagine potentially the greatest discovery in human history collecting dust? What do you make of the vision? I'm not gonna lie. I really wish I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge otherwise. Both you and Barrett saw something. I don't think that's a coincidence. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but you know, if the label fits. You think this was a religious experience? Not necessarily, no, but it does kind of have the hallmarks of one, doesn't it? I'm certainly not going to rule it out just yet. Was fancy rock just sentient? Oh wait, it's okay. The Twilight CGI baby can't hurt you anymore. Oh my god, that was... Oh my god. I still... Okay, out of all five... Five movies, right? Yeah, out of all five movies, I still... Like, one, one and two just because of how... How awkward freaking everything was in the first one. Two was is good because of how stupid Bella can be. And four and f three was like, eh. And four and five, Breaking Dawn part one and two is like, all right. I didn't lose you, did I? Oh, sorry. I was talking about Twilight in my head. It meant something. I didn't understand it. Okay. That's all right. Maybe you weren't supposed to. Maybe it'll make sense later. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. I want these freaking artifact enough? rock Maybe things to just start artifacts. talking to me. What well, brought you to Constellation? Well, there was some overlap in interests. I'd spent years searching for religious relics from human history. I had made a really incredible discovery, only to lose it to a greedy corporation. <coughs> well, what would you so discover? I tried to steal it back. In the process, I met Walter. Turned out he owned the corporation. Oh. After a long talk, we realized we had a lot in common. And I was invited to join Constellation. <clears throat> nice. Take care of yourself. I've occasionally had my doubts about Constellation as an investment. Now, Whenever you're up for it, we have work to do. Yeah, I, I'm ready. Uh, I should probably ask you about Not your much, lore. But you've seen them for yourself. It doesn't take a lot to realize we're dealing with something extraordinary. Just what that is, we'll have to figure out. It's what we do. How well is how well known as constellation? I don't know what you've heard, but I can imagine. First of all, I think you can dismiss any stories about us no longer existing. Hmm? I don't believe in smearing our name everywhere we can. I've never heard of you Exploring guys. Exploring the universe, charting the unknown, that's what counts. Besides, having a little mystery gives us room to maneuver. A fixed reputation could fence us in a lot of ways. What is Constellation? What do you do? We're explorers. Humanity has always hunted for knowledge in the unknown. We just take that a little more seriously than others. We were founded decades ago by a man named Sebastian Banks. He wanted a small group of people from all corners of the settled systems dedicated to the biggest question of all. What's out there? These artifacts out there? are everything we've been looking for. Another great secret the universe is asking us to Wait, unlock. Wait, when did they find the artifacts? I'm assuming so, so the dude just created this organization he's like ale let's go explore space you guys there's got to be something and y'all just chill about it all right i'm ready we're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work the artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock that means people can pass them around not even knowing what they are I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects yeah, they're all in caves how the heck noise, usually but a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Other people have artifacts. We have to assume that we're not the only ones to have stumbled into Yeah, that makes mystery. sense. But most people aren't going into space. There may be like a space heist known. quest, man. Places to settle, resources to extract, That'd be cool. to defend. An odd-looking rock or a single strange hunk of metal wouldn't mean much to them. 
that's why constellations yeah, what are the odds that someone will like find us put pieces like this together piece of rock and break it or something you know the uc vanguard a volunteer force that helps defend the edges of united colonies space united They're colony vanguard Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals, it's like mercenaries, part timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. Or My more contact like... is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. Vigilante guards. Good chance to learn more about the United Colonies. Jumping to anthropology on me already. Oh well, good. We all need our own reasons Heist to be out there. Son of a. But it's not I'm just in. that. I want to take Man. this opportunity to Space see how heist. you handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. Locked as your follower if you continue. Yeah, I... What do I get out of this anyway? Constellation have a salary. You mean besides the ship, the robot, and a place to stay all rent-free? We do have some funds we can disperse from time to time. Not to mention, I think we can get you a proper suit. Wait, you don't like my We're suit? explorers. We keep a lot of equipment on hand for that purpose. So the more you work with us, the more we can share what we have. Wait. All right. All right. We need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen. Whatever you were before, or whatever you do once you're out there, How I don't care. Oh. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? You don't care if I steal as long as I don't get caught? I mean, Constellation has a roster of members who haven't always been on the right side of their respective society. We're risk takers. Some of us have seen the inside of a jail cell more than once. If you join Are us, you one of them? it means you're committed to our mission. In exchange, we give you latitude in your choice of means. Hey, yeah, all right. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? There is available for your crew. There is now your active... We need to talk to John Tuala in Mast. Personal questions. How do you know there was an artifact in like, You can Terra? thank Barrett for that, if he's still around to thank when this is all said and done. Honestly, this is already on hard mode. This seriously before any of I haven't been in combat in like at his two hours. That we started doing deep space scans. I will admit. It was something of a shock to see Barrett taking anything seriously. Looks like she went to jail for not paying her, her spice latte. Oh my god. Trade gear. No. So long. I am at your service, Captain. Right, I see you, Vasco. Talk to Sarah's contact. Over by mass. Already here. All right. You have a nice oh, day it's now. like a. What the heck? How far is this? Okay, surely, surely, no, oh. No, uh, no fall damage from this, right? Go in the water? Oh, bless. Oh my god, no, that's... 
Are we swimming? Okay, we're swimming. I thought I thought we were. Graphics look good so far. No, it is pretty good. It's pretty good. We're so I mean, they're still running on the same uh the same engine Welcome for over Mast. if you have an appointment twenty or so years inside. or something. Uh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get I'll jump in that water. Don't want to break my legs again. I know you could break your legs in this. Huh. What's the Vanguard? United Colonies volunteer fleet. Independent captains enlist, get to use their own ships, and the UC provides them with sustained work and credits. And put in your time, and you're guaranteed UC citizenship and everything that comes with it. Discounts on UC goods and medical services. Chance to own a place in New Atlantis. Only way a foreign captain could even Wait. dream of seeing those sorts of benefits. Does that mean so, I have to do you your work? In? Maybe later. We have constellation business to discuss first. All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? I mean, I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to re-enlist. It's a game we play. He asks. I say no. Here's what I got for you two. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. Damn. The Sol system? Which Admiral did he upset to get that posting? How far is that? Born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Hmm. Okay. Who's this Mora? Oh, he goes way back. I think it was recruit number 81 or something. What's wrong with the soul system? You kidding? Lowest posting request rate in the whole fleet. Only thing there the UC cares about is Mars. And no one wants to go to Mars. They want to get off Mars. I mean, it's just a desert, I'd assume. Some patrol you could be putting our item at risk. What? <laughs> nah. Soul system is as quiet as a coffin. Oh, I know you jinxed it, dude. That means it's not going to be fine. I'm sure you two can handle it. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sedona Moera. on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Important business, you know? Hey, you can tell me about... Maybe they should try going to... Uranus. Yeah. Bring a Uranus. Eurectum. You're so used to seeing red, you'll forget what blues and greens look like. Or if... Say where he found this ornament of his. You'll have to ask him. But Vanguard volunteers have retrieval rights if they get into a scrap. Uh-huh. Wouldn't be surprised if he found it off of a pirate or something like that. All right. Thanks for your help, John. Anything for Sarah. UC always takes care of its own. Even the prodigal children. No, oh, brother. I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. You just come talk to me when you're ready. UC is a good friend to have. Oh, I was supposed hey, to freaking ask Sarah. about the... Oh, I am supposed to ask. All right, my bad. Welcome back. Here to find. Well, all right. Take the elevator down to the Vanguard. Oh shoot! I didn't mean to freaking register. That guy seems too nice. Cully Bear ain't fooling me. Something wrong with the exam? A Cully Bear Bear look. process for joining me. All right, just want to see what else. Sidonia, Sidonia. Oh, geez, uh, where's our, where's our? Where's our ship? 
Our ship's here. Where to next? Time to take off. Also, like, yeah, I'm, I think I'm on high graphics, but with, like, a bit of lower resolution textures just to at least keep my frames when streaming. Use alt, wised, or arrow key. Yeah, alt. You can adjust where you put your power sourced towards pretty neat anyway where are we going soul system right fuel consumption Beepity boop. Whoa. Goddamn flashbang. Prepare to be scanned for contraband. No contraband on ship. You oh, are clear to land. We are contraband. Enjoy your stay at Sidonia. Sidonia. Mars. I be Earth. I do be Earth. Sindonia. It's a little dry. I kind of do. I mean, there was a person. Oh, back on uh, New Atlantis saying how he loves collecting old Earth artifacts or like like spoons and stuff, plates from Earth. So like, I don't know man, maybe, maybe uh, no one really wants to be on Earth. Oh shoot. Oh no, wait, 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 maybe, 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 maybe wear a, a suit? You know, that would make sense. Else in your helmet. Carrying two of these? So we are. Constellation pack. Don't forget to zip up your fly. I kinda don't wanna don't wanna just go right outside without anything, huh? Environmental damage in ships outposts and places you can relax and breathe safely. Wait, why am I dying? Hold up. Status, health. Oh, I'm fine. Alright. They get their own ship? Their ship, their own suit, I guess. Leeches. I suppose that would explain the brownouts. So, what's this going to run? If there are no other surprises, mid five figures. Damn, you screwed, dude. Five figures? Five? Fine. Do it. I'll be at the bar. Environmental Find me damage, which has We're on it, sir. lowered your max health. Building Sedonia to keep relax. the underground was a safely. way of keeping the city shielded from the harsh Martian landscape. 
Okay, okay. I'm assuming inside here should be fine. Take off my suit. Yeah, I mean, she has her suit off. <laughs> my trucker hat. I thought I would unequip it. Do I have to manually unequip it? we spent to hitch a ride to this dusty red rock. We were told there were jobs. Look, 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 I get it. But we just filled our last openings. I think we have a couple contracts right, we'll at the on. end of next month. Possible. Mining takes all time. Fine going. We've got cold beers and good atmosphere. Not much more you could ask for. I'm looking for a vanguard named Moera. He ain't been around. Went off on patrol, hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the Blackest Sea. The Blackest Sea? You got another word for it? Oh. He means out of space. Oh. Ma'am. We could track him down if you know his patrol route. Oh, believe me, I've heard it. After about round three or four was all he would talk about. And he's got a voice that carries. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially one that's missing. But <clears throat> Well damn. Now what? He has a tab and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but if I'm out all that money. I got problems. Well, how much is this tab? They speak on your behalf. What they will say is written next to their name. Oh, it's a little bit persuading. You could need help. You shouldn't put a price on that. Come on. Life on Sidonia ain't hard enough. You're gonna guilt trip me. What matters to you more? What matters to you more? The money? Or Moera's life. Guess I should ask you the same question. You paying or what? Well, it could be the only ones who could find him. And maybe he's not gonna get found. I'm out the cash either way. Okay, this ain't working. <laughs> Every minute that passes, he could be in danger. That's how the blackest sea works sometimes. That's enough. Well, damn. You either pay up or get out. I'm done talking about this. Uh, let's go to the part where you admit you're lying. No, I've done this routine. Let's skip to the part where you admit you're lying about what he owes. You calling me a liar? I'll throw both of you out of this bar right now. You tried. We tried. Please. Two strangers arrived from Offworld asking for information only you have. You see an opportunity. Everyone always does. Lower the price. Don't think we can't find another way to get what we want. Fine. A thousand? Yeah, alright. Here's your money. Agreed on a discount, right? 
Let me confirm the email. Okay. Let's talk. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love. <laughs> Singing songs. All that kind of thing. What? Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Oh, fine. We'll make do. Just gotta go to Venus. Most mm. visitors can't wait to get off this rock. Oh, we tried. That was a pleasant change of scenery. Can I skip this? Set course to Venus. Can't skip a loading screen disguise as a takeoff animation. Yeah, that's what I figured. Set course to Venus. Here. Hello, what do we have here? See that cluster of ships? Yeah. Zealots. You ever run into one? <laughs> Completely devoted to a deity they call the Great Serpent. The devourer of the unbelievers. I'll let you guess what happens if they spot us. Oh, do you see a Moera ship anywhere? No. So we should just leave? Why are Veyron Zealots out here near Venus? No idea. They appear and attack people seemingly at random. I think they attack Moera. The Veyron. So I doubt they know where our vanguard is. But I think I see something else that might. What? Without being attacked, got it. Exactly. Minimal ship power. Go slow. We grab the data on that satellite and jump away. Minimize the ship power to avoid system for maximum stealth power down all systems except right on all systems except one or two bars in your engine. Wait, it's probably get within five hundred meters. All right. Yeah. Oh, great serpent. Bless this communion that we may walk in Janan Verun's footsteps. That he jumped from the soul system out into the beyond and touched your magnificence. That he learned the truth of the shrouding, the coming eternal embrace. That you the Star Trek power the location thing. Oh, true. Also that. I was thinking of like, uh, I think Elite Dangerous also does it. Oh, Power of the Shields kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good old Star Trek. So. How close? How, how close that to be? 500? 
Wish I could look without moving the thing. We're almost there. Really want to try this game now? You have Game Pass? Or wait, or do you just... Or, or is it not on... Or do you only have a... Uh, like, the PlayStation? Yes, Ali, it's selected and press yes. No R. Moira. Oh, it's my roommate's Xbox. I'm sure they can let me borrow. Ah, yeah, surely. Galactic Star Yard. Get the hell out of here. Let's uh, go to the moon. Oh, there it is. Nova Galactic Star Yard, still orbiting Earth's moon. <laughs> this is where the first interstellar ships were made. Crazy. Why would he be there? What happened to Earth anyway? Why did we leave uh, it? It's all ancient history now, but the Earth lost its atmosphere. It started sputtering out into space. Humanity had about 50 years to evacuate the planet. That's kind of how the United Colonies government started. Ah. Managing the exodus. Earth is more or less a dust ball now. That's fair. You can occasionally find a few remnants of the world we left behind on the surface, but... Damn. Forget about finding the artifact. I want to walk on the moon. Well, if you want to take a little detour, I admit I wouldn't say no. Just remember, we need to find Vanguard Moara and that artifact. Oh, I thought you would done. say no. Most star stations and ships can be docked with allowing you to board them. You only select a ship in your HUD and then fly close enough so it can dock. It's crazy. Anyone on board? All right, guess we dock him. Gotta get like a Game Pass trial, one dollar, thirty day trial or something. Board. Well, that was fun. Now what? Well, now what? There's a dead body right in front of you. Yeah. Scavenging around here and someone else killed. Just Min and said hello. Oh, this won't be your last encounter with a spacer crew. They pillage abandoned facilities and shoot anyone who gets in their way. They're even less organized than the Crimson Fleet. Just countless desperate groups scavenging and killing to survive. Utility flight suit. That thought was a safe. Oh, more Kraken. Where do you have that?
Okay. Who's our big brain for this? That doesn't get the other one. This is okay. That's not good for that. That's pretty good for those. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Uh, uh. Missing that piece though. That one's useless. We don't need that. Okay. This can cover four of these. We just need that last. Nah, it's not going to be a long game. Great suits just matching the lines of the spaces, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, lockpicks. Using a lockpick. Use one lockpick to get into, like, the minigame. And then you can undo, but that uses up a lockpick if you, like, see that you messed up something. Which is pretty neat. Physical fire rate. Uh, yeah, why not? It's like I have to put these in my quick slot every time, though. Fire rate don't really matter. I don't really care. All of these Krakens, I could care less. Ray leather jumpsuit. Semi metal wafer for crafting. Yeah. Modified. boy I don't sound good I'm sure they had something we can use I don't sound good at all as I rummage through the bathroom Pay. 
Oh. Have ammo for this gun? Can't shoot through that? Got it. They hack each other? Guess so. Get out of here. Let's try a grenade. Oh shoot, we need healing. Here for can I get Here's the old big head of healing. Exactly. <laughs> One person have health? There we go. This is something. Are you sure now? Oh. Die from that? Still alive? Crawling? Uh oh. Uh oh. I thought I'd have, you know, ammo for this pistol, but I, I guess not, huh? <laughs> Alright, does this say what ammo it uses? Ultra Mag. Ah! Oh, it does on the side. 7.7 millimeters. Medic deep mining space suit. Boosted star roamer space suit. Oh, let's grab that. Where are we?
Rendell. <laughs> Navigator pack. Are they encumbered? Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, drop. Let's go axe. You don't need any more. The cutter. Oh, let's keep that. Wait, is there a way to sort by, like, junk? Probably not. Maelstrom. Okay. Actually, do anything? EM. Utility of flight suit. Auto medic deep mining spacesuit. Human blend with environment and was sneaking and not moving. Auto medic automatically uses a med pack when hit and held us. Alright. Get all that stuff out of here. Get away from me. Well, 
I suppose they're not going to need it anymore. Anything good here? Uh oh. So find someone? You shouldn't. Oh my god, explode. It's heavy. Damn, that hurt. Ray engineering suit. Getting the hell out of here. This is Vanguard Moira. Sorry if I had to reclaim some UC property, but this whole star yard is overrun. I've patched up my ship and I'm heading to Neptune. Going to put in another request to get the fleet out here to deal with these spacers. But until then, if any of you thugs are listening, I'm the damn ghost stealing your stuff in the night. Clear out while you have the chance. Oh shoot, he's knifing me. How do you? <laughs> oh no. I'm dead. Our back is bring us. Foster and hydrate.
Oh. Why aren't the gifts working? The heck? That's weird. I'll fix that for next time. Uh, shit. Here we go again. Anything else? No. Down. Peak. Did the redeem go off? Huh? No, no, I didn't. I'll have to fix it for next time. I don't know, have a... What else do we have? I don't have any rounds for that. God damn. Bring it on. What's that suit do? But anyway, environment was taken and not moving. Any other grenades? Throwables. Fragmentation mine. Oh shoot! Why why did he throw it that close? <laughs> oh my god. That's pretty goofy. Caught in the blast. Yeah, honest. Uh oh. Y'all saw nothing. Oh, they saw it. Okay, here we go again. What does that mean? Go with 20 enemies. Did we not do that? I thought we did. Berserker. Hey, on. Let's see. Uh, 
not gonna last much longer. The others down there. Well, I mean, fall down here. Hey, where am I? Hey, where the hell? Whoa, whoa! I think she was just frozen for a sec. That was pretty funky. Entire area first. Stab you. Uh oh. Not good. This is gonna end badly for you. <sighs> We're halfway to killing. You kill like 20 enemies with a pistol. Where's Batty at? Is he above? Well, he's gone now. Alright. I don't stock up on junk. This is Vanguard Moira. Sorry if I had to reclaim some UC property, but this whole star yard is overrun. I've patched up my ship and I'm heading to Neptune. Going to put in another request to get the fleet out here to deal with these spacers. But until then, if any of you thugs are visiting, I'm the damn ghost stealing your stuff in the night. Clear out while you have the chance. He's always daring the spaces to come after him. It's actually not a bad plan. Much better odds destroying one of their ships than fighting all at once here. There. Looks like it's Neptune next. Not at all. Very well. Next time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Goodbye. All right, I forgot I can trade to have her hold stuff for me. Hopefully, I'll only carry the good stuff.
If you have any gear. Inventory. I don't even know why I have that. Freaking ammo for that. Side star. Plus twenty percent against robots. Less armor one has. Wait, did you have my helmet? Looks like it's nip. Have something for me? Yeah, you do. Maybe another time. was a pack. Let's go down. Find anything useful? More firing. The side star compared. Q. 
cube. The grenade. to Neptune. Chill. If you stop shooting at us, we'd be more than happy to respond. White line a couple of them, but they'd lock me down. Really could use an assist. We blow that ship out of the stars, he's dead, and our artifacts gone. We're going to have to board. Target the engines. Once they stall out, we'll have our chance. Okay.
is it done? You don't want to blow it up, right? Most of all, ships can be aboard when ship's engines are down. Just fly close to the ship before you will... What you bore expect to... That's it. Start the docking routine. Come on. Let's go rescue that vanguard. Alright. Let's go rescue that vanguard. It's good to be back on board. What is that helmet? Thank you. I got to meet whoever you two are. Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? Who were those people? How did they hijack your Ecliptic ship? Ecliptic mercs. They don't work for anyone. Ecliptic. And vanguards don't exactly make friends with local pirates, thieves, and scavengers. I think enough of them finally got fed up and they pooled their money to hire professionals. Breaching a hostile ship and saving lives. My kind of party. Now I know that kind of talk. You two Marines? Constellation, actually. What? Seriously? Man, I've heard stories, but I had no idea you all were this dangerous. We've heard stories, too. About a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? Oh my god. I'm going to grow on about half as a scientist everywhere. And then you're going to hand over the artifact. Hey, sorry. I just didn't know what it was. But that's I guess fair. that's what you all are for, right? Here. Happy to trade a novelty for a rescue any day. Let's grab the artifact. Oh my god, dude. Blink. Good work. Let's get back to the lodge. All 
really have anything else in there, do you? Medical tree. Old Earth cuisine. Barrel mods. Pretty neat. Back to the lodge. One. It's a lodge. Mind if we stop by the waterfall on this trip? I could use a few moments to unwind. Nah. It's restabilized. There you Is go. New showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. It's 
an honor to be part of this. What does it mean to be a full member? Honestly, this just makes it more official. Call it right person, right place, right time. But once the artifacts started coming together, you were one of us. I expected champagne. Well, if you ever find a relic bottle from Earth, we'll all be happy to share it with you. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm yeah, why going not? to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. Yeah, all right. Why ask me? Why not someone who's been here longer? Oh, we'll be working with everyone here at the Lodge sooner or later. Constellation is all in on this. Sometimes we'll partner up, sometimes we'll go solo. It's not a formal arrangement. We just came back with good news. We've got momentum. Why not keep going? You got it. All right. We've got a few more leads we should talk about. Sarah Morgan loves First, that. there's an expedition that Sam Co has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been the hard eye. at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it. No other word. Hmm. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Oh, a thousand. That's crazy. What's the eye? Who's that? No, it's fine. Okay. Craft specials, yeah. Okay. That's enough. We've always been star field for now. Wars? Thanks for doing it again. We'll be back tomorrow. Do Minecraft. It's it's not bad. I don't know. Maybe maybe there's something about Bethesda games that just don't get me. I don't know. It's, it's, I mean, it's like it's not a bad game. It's really not a bad game. Well, there is something... Something that feels... I don't know. But well, that's just me. That's just me. You know, it's just the... <laughs> th playing Starfield, but then thinking, Oh, man. I could be playing some Planescape. Definitely, I definitely want to try more. Just to like, just to really, because yeah, I didn't get too into it, right? So, yeah. Have a good night. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.